Oh, I guess oh, we'll start a few seconds earlier. The song just ended very sort of in time, <laughs> almost in time. Hello, everybody. Uh, yeah, better late than than uh, never, right? Uh, a little bit of work, a little bit of other stuff to prepare. Uh, but I did fire up the stream anyways a bit late now. But here's the thing. The twins are with uh, my wife and a relative for today and tomorrow and maybe a little bit off uh, Friday as well. So technically I could do whatever I want. The thing is I have to work tomorrow again. So the, the whatever I want thingy is, is not going to happen. Uh, unfortunately um and yeah tomorrow is a uh, present day at work so that that obviously sucks a little bit uh let's say hi to those who are already here we have matt katarin lady hellcat mr lusty will jonesy fonsui kalku shorty elax teru chethros epais sergarash darkness descended derfin clubs edley and eve of belgi did speak up it's bachelor week yeah sort of uh, you know I, I also have to do uh all the things right that normally are being done by my wife though so yeah, but i think i can manage i just had a snack oh uh, i have my drink i hope it's not leaking today um yeah and, and, and the project let's see how, where that goes is there anything else it, uh actually i'm a little bit of an issue in my audio levels at the moment at least the ones i can hear i believe for you it is fine why oh, is it a bit too much for me okay that's probably gonna work now good afternoon call. Maybe if you eat a ton of garlic, they'll ask you to work from home. Uh, you know, I only have, what, like 20 minutes drive from work? Or, well, if I leave from work 20 minutes later, I can fire up the stream. So I, I will definitely be streaming tomorrow. Uh, well, you know, if nothing really horrible happens. In terms of... um, Okay, let's set the stage. Imagine you're coming back to Eve a couple of years in or later with a break. You don't know what's going on. Uh, you, you check your wallet and, and there's only 5 million on it, right? What do you do? Let's find out. Um, the plan here is to start with a 5 million budget and run the abyss at least up to tier 5 at some point. I want to see if I can, or how fast I can self-sustain, sort of build my equipment and then ladder the tiers. Uh, that, that's sort of the stage there and uh, well now we have to figure out things i actually have no idea about pricing of filaments we need to take that into account i do have a preferred sort of path in terms of ships slash weaponry but uh it, it really depends on if the uh, filaments are actually going to work or not or not double it in chida no we will we will only increase that five million by running the abyss and uh well use the isk we get there or the, the things we get there and sell to the market um to upgrade the ships also we might be mutaplasmiting mute mutaplasming i don't know we, we will apply mutaplasmids do you have ships no i don't have anything so five million is where we start and we have to damn make sure that whatever we go for is is gonna fit into that budget and we've survived the first few missiles to you know get back the invest i don't think i can make it two and a half mil sort of run in order to have a second attempt if, if shit hits the fan punish your electrical uh actually here's the thing the electrical filaments are fairly expensive but let, let's see um we are going for i think i will not start with tier zero tier zero is uh uh that's for those who never played the abyss so we'll start with tier one and uh they are called calm oops i shouldn't have eat, eaten the snack calm all right calm dark filaments 1000 no, actually, 18,000 disc. Why does it say 1,840? Because people are buying it for that money. Okay. Price history. Oh, they recently jumped. Wow. The dark filaments went up in price because, I don't know. <laughs> there must be a reason, right? Okay. Um, dark filaments, 18k. Electrical, 14k. Okay, that's interesting. Um, Then we got 58,000 for the exotic ones. 300 is for the firestorms. Ah, oh. and 1,500 for the gamma filaments. Okay, that's tier one. Tier one, I would be tempted to actually go the electrical route because that's gonna be fairly easy to progress up to probably tier tier two in a frigate. Same for for dark in a way. Hello, trouble trade greetings. Okay, calm. Let's see what the 
agitated does for us. Agitated dark is 8k. Electrical is becoming more expensive. Exotic is cheaper. Firestorm is, well, obviously still cheapest. And Gamma is... Uh, so what's the cheapest? Cheapest is dark for tier 2. Okay. Uh, let's see what Fierce does. Uh, by the way, I'm not limiting myself here to just run one account, right? It could be that I will fire up a second account at some point and, you know, buy a ship for that with the money I make here. So this is not limited to one single character. Okay, Fierce. Dark is 60. Electrical is not an option. Exotic even less. Firestorm, well, <laughs> nobody wants to run Firestorm. Gamma is not really an option, so I, I believe we, we're we're fighting between Dark and Electrical at this point. And from what I can tell, so if I will go with two or three frigates, man, it's ten times more expensive to run Electricals than Darks, except for the Calm ones. And I will not stay at Calm for long. So I don't think I want to go down the Punisher route. I, I will end up in Dark somehow. And uh, go through Kestrel. I don't know. Destroyer. Uh, no, maybe maybe I want to try a Hawk for a while in Tier 2 solo. And then eventually upgrade to a Tier 3 Jackdaw. Or maybe not even. Yeah, tier, tier 3 Jackdaw could work for a while, and then we'll go with a Tier 4 and 5, I don't know, Sacrilege, Cerberus, oh, whatever, um, comes up there. Fonsui says, all it costs to run a Firestorm is 300 disc and replacing your ship right there, Fonsui. Greetings, VA James. Um, look at how much the average loot is. Ooh, Sergrash has an interesting link for us. Greetings, Sertillion. So the idea for those just joining, we want to start with 5 million isk and eventually run tier 5 abyssals. Let's see how we get there. Now, um, average loot. Oh god, how does this website work? Hold on a second. I'll pull that up for you. Um, that one? No? Okay. That one. Perfect. Ooh. Let's, how do we do this? Let's reset, transform. And check the abyss tracker here for a bit. Okay. Um, I'm not talking to your account. I'm talking, you know, returning player. Doesn't know what happened the last couple of years. Has 5 million in his account and, and nothing else. I don't know, because he was drunk when he left the game. What can we do with 5 million of invest? How fast will we be? Uh, good at the abyss that's the idea so i'm assuming you have some skills although here's the thing it will take a while and you can train skills along the way so you'll, you'll see okay so loot table is that the loot table i'm supposed to look at right oh uh, no oh uh, yeah so calm calm dark oh wait no that's not huh overview Overview. Oh, there. Dark. Calm. Profitability. 1.7 million isk. 80% of runs are more profitable than that. Okay. So that that's tier 1. Oh, wait. That's in a cruiser. In a frigate. We will we'll be starting with in a frigate, right? So in a frigate, we will get 4 million something per run. If I read that correctly. Okay, dark, 4 million per run. Let's see what we do with the electricals. How much SP does the account have? Uh, this account has a lot of SP, but since we're starting with uh, Frigate and Small Weaponry, Ezinum, it, it will not really matter that much at the beginning. Later, it might be quite relevant. Again, later, you had some time to train into skills, and you might even use some of these ISKs you make for... Uh, upgrading your skill point situation. Okay, let's go. Calm Electrical. Calm Electrical. Calm Electrical seems to have the same profitability. Uh, let's go with 
But let's check tier 2. I will be running tier 2 quite a while, I believe, with with a probably assault frigate. Alright, let's go overview and we want to check agitated dark. Agitated dark. Hello, web page. It's not very fast. <laughs> okay, now agitated dark. It's gonna net all 9.8 million per run in a frigate. 9.8 million and then we check out the electrical that would be agitated electrical it's the same i would say and uh eventually the tier 3 i believe tier 3 dark is going to be way better in in dark but that's just my guess let's see dark fierce fierce dark is gonna yield 25 million per run whereas the electrical one uh, fierce electrical 21 so from tier 3 i believe electrical is gonna lose and uh, not i believe i mean the numbers here say i will be way faster just going the dark route so we will go at uh, the dark route um ba james is glad it turned in today looking forward to this all right hello asteroid close greetings and hello to uh, guarov as well are you handing in there handing in what i'm not handing in anything uh, what, what? Uh, wait wait ba james what was the difference? Electrical gives you more capacitor. Yes, it does. And dark makes it so that you're faster and turrets are penalized, meaning tanking is going to be easier generally. Tanzi, thanks for the follow. Welcome to the channel. Dark is speed up, range down. If you were running guns, if you're running missiles, it doesn't change anything, right? And uh, wait, I'm hanging in there. I'm, I'm always hanging in there, right? <laughs> Okay, so for me, this looks like I should go dark overall. Um, let's do that. Oh yeah, okay. So I have 5 million and I have to buy filaments plus I have to have a ship. And I will need to run at least two or three filaments to be able to buy a new ship. So I will start with calm dark and I, I need three filaments, right? That's the... That's the start. Three filaments. I'm going to buy three filaments right now. That's 56,000. Why are they so expensive? Somebody effed the market with this. Okay, 56,000 for Calm Darks. Um, Jesus Christ, where did I just buy this? Oh, in, in Chida. Yeah, I should, maybe I should go over there, right? I'm still in, uh, in a player structure where I dumped my clone. So, clone is empty. And we are heading to Chida. I have 4,943,000 disc left. Now let's find a ship we can build with that money. Um, I'm fairly certain it is not going to be an assault frigate right away. So we will have to, to most likely settle with uh, with a Kestrel. Bonsui, what do you think? What, what would you do? Tier 1 Dark. You have a little bit less than 5 million. What do you go for? Hello, Zero Man, sorry, greetings. Sometimes trying to help backfires. I'm just uh, double checking. Would you would you consider the Kestrel a good sort of point, a starting point? Because I do, but maybe, you know, you have something really cool in mind that is way better. Kestrel is the only choice, really. Okay. All right, well, let's do Kestrel from scratch. Uh, a Kestrel is going to send me that back 486,000. And, uh, well, let's see. I know Tech 2 launchers are not the cheapest things to kind of start with, but we'll see how much that is going to set me back, right? A missile launcher, we will go with... Oh, should I go rocket, actually? Hmm. Ah, greetings, Tianya. Welcome, everybody, joining in. We're doing 5 million isk. Starting money for Bissels, and we'll see where it goes. Are you going... Uh, alpha? No. This is just the 5 million as an Omega player. We will not do the Alpha thing because that will not go to tier 5, so Phenom. I want to go to tier 5. I want to see how fast I can do that with decent skills and, well, the fastest route for if you just have 5 uh, million. You've got some fits for me? Ah, I will I will do them from scratch. That's sort of part of the content there. Let's see what I come up with. Alright, so, um, as I said, should I go Rocket? 
rocket is more DPS. Kind of like rockets. But here's the thing. Four rocket launchers. Is this... Why is this... Okay, there we go. Two million. Two million just for the rocket launchers. That's kind of uh, pretty pretty harsh. Um, But I, I, I believe I really should... I should go there. What's my range in the Kestrel with... Let's say, do we have a bonus on the Kestrel? No, there is there's no damage type bonus, so we will probably end up running Explosive as a default. Um, Alright, let's go Nova Rage. Nova Rage is going to go 13 kilometers. That's actually not too bad. I think I can work with that. And worst case, we will bring some Javelins, right? Okay, let's, let's bring, I don't know, 2k Novas to make it cheap, and then... Let's have a look at the range for javelins. Javelins are going to go 23 kilometers. That is beautiful. Do not want to spend any isk on faction ammo yet because that's probably going to kill my budget fairly quickly. All right, we'll, we'll go with javelins. Let's bring another 2k javelins. And that is it on the ammo front now. We need some tank. Uh, I guess a prop mod is going to be warranted. There is no way we will not have an afterburner. So we'll just put that in. I think I will I will go with cheap stuff first. Mm, how about... Doesn't matter. Oh wait, that's a 10 MN. We probably want to go. So compact is 42 million and enduring is one is uh, 42,000 isk. And this one is almost free. So we'll, we'll go with this one. Not waste too much isk. Uh, at the start, Mercury readings. Once he says, if you're starting with only 5 million isk, you're doing a dark site, then... I don't think anything but Kestrel will cut it. Yeah, that's that's how we have to have to go. Tier one is gonna be the start. Um soften um. I wanna get things done. Playing Garistus ammo should not be that expensive. Actually lately Garistus ammo was more expensive than the uh, navy uh, blah blah. Didn't Chaos just show that afterburners are completely optional? <laughs> I don't know, did he? Alright, we will go nine hundred and nine well almost a thousand meters a second. And since we are running a dark, um Abyss, we will be even faster than, than that. So speed is, is not really going to gonna be an issue. Um, I want to have an invuln. That's going to set me back quite a bit. Multi-spectrum shield. Jeez, Louise. I think we need to go with... Oh, let's go with an endure... No. Multi-spectrum shield hardener. I think I have to go with a meta one. To be able to afford it, because... The tech 2 just costs 2 million. So I know what's going to happen here. We will have a lot of... um. Wait, did I just... Yeah. We will have a lot of meta stuff, which we will eventually be able to upgrade to tech 2. But let's let's go in as cheap as possible. The rigs, I, I'd rather not want to change too often, but I think they will be... Yeah, they will be tier 1. Or tech 1 to, to start with. Okay. I'm obviously not done with the tank here. We need a little bit more than that. Uh, oh, boy. It's gonna be shaky, right? We just have to survive a few, and then then we'll make money. Boost amplifiers? No. Let's go with a. Can I put a medium shield booster in here? I can. I'll do medium. And uh, yeah, lows. Ballistic controls. The thing is, tech one or well. Tech 1 is, is, is real shitty. Tech 2 is a million a pop. I might end up just having one of these, so but let's get one ballistic control system here. Uh, the, the faction ones are, are 3 million a pop, so that's not gonna, not gonna work. You can see I have a CPU problem here quite significantly already, which we will have to deal with eventually. It's not a fresh, a fresh character deem this go. It's uh, you return to EVE after a couple of years of break and you want to do something new. And this is how you start with a 5 million bitchet. A bitchet, bitchet, a budget. This one's going to be a bitch to fly, that's for sure. Uh, one compact blows your whole budget. Yeah, we cannot go compact. Um, how's it called? Compact ballistic control. How much DPS will I push with Nova rockets? 157. That's, um, that's something. I might have, seriously, just to, to save... Wait... Is it tech one less less CPU? Uh, um, I'll try a tech two, 
And I think I need a rig to help me with CPU here. Oh, fairly certain. So let's go and put in a engineering rig small command processor. Is that the thing? No. How is it called? Processor overclocking unit. There we go. We will, we will we'll need one of these. Um, and then I can fit two ballistic control. Oh my god. Should I? Holy moly. What do we put here? I have an empty mid slot. Cannot really put a battery there, but man, my capacitor looks like that's that's not gonna be fun, right? Oh boy, oh boy. Why don't you use the Kestrel fit from Abyssal Lurkers? Uh, Eve Belgi, just copying a fit from somewhere now would defeat the purpose of creating content. So here we are, we are learning something about fitting the panes there. Big pop coming? A web to drop the da the Damovic spool. Oh, a web. Yeah, I five <laughs> CPU, so <laughs> now I have twenty two. We could we could go for a web. Yeah, defensive web could be a thing to to survive the Damovic there. I, I'm I'm really really not happy with my with my um capacitor as you can see there. Thirty seconds is that's tight. <laughs> I, I think we need we need something to survive capacitor wise here instead. Uh, battery is not gonna work, so a recharger might might have to to do. I mean, 157 DPS. I can get 185 if I heat the shit out of this, which is quite good actually. So I, I will try to to get some more cap into my low there what does that do capacitor which one doesn't hurt my shield boost that one here and then i have one rig you can do a tier one under 100 dps yeah i'd rather have a, a lot of dps just to you know <laughs> not waste too much time okay i'll have to uh, let's put a restraint in there to not kill our budget and then empty rig slots let's get a small engineering rig capacitor control circuit 51 seconds i think that should do it i have i have a fair amount of dps here if shit's hitting the fan 180 dps i will clear the field quickly so it doesn't hurt me too long i think i can survive with that okay we got this i cannot really afford paste so there's that can we discuss the benefits of the mid slot cap modules uh for sure Here's the thing, I oh wait, I might be able to actually put a battery in now. I just realized, hold on. Battery's gonna fit. What did I do? Why do I have so much CPU now? Oh wait, that guy is not, not using a lot. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Cap booster, you know, is gonna cost me charges. I'd rather not. If I can, can I fit the medium compact battery? No. Okay, that would have been... <laughs> Uh, pretty hilarious. Okay, look at that. We go to almost two minutes of cap with this. Tech two would be two and a half minutes. Uh, that that would even be within my budget. How much is a no? I think we will do this. Should I go YOLO? Something like this. Is this within my... Can I buy this? 4.3 million. I could buy this. And I will run 180 cold. 220 hot. I think I'm gonna go YOLO. Actual prices is less than what it shows here. That's new, right? Yeah, price estimates are usually not exactly what what you're gonna pay, but they're sort of here, right? Okay, one minute, one minute of cap. I think I can do this. This this looks good. I I will. Yeah, we'll do this. Do I need something else? No. Yes. Okay, this is it. 
fit chip. Let's hit it. 5M. Challenge. Rockets don't require a cap. No, not at all. So yeah, if I run out of cap, I can still shoot. Okay, and now I bought three Calm Dark Filaments just before... Oh, wait, we need two. Where's my Kestrel now? Kestrel? There. Calm Dark. Boom. This is it. Are we going to make it out? We'll find out. Oh, uh, um, the skin will not count towards the... I guess budget. Oh, yay. <laughs> so, social, socially obsolete says price estimates are based on the universe-wide average price. And and they also lag behind a, a couple of days, I believe, right? Okay. This is my entry ticket. I still have 600,000 desk to buy some more. Uh, let's load Nova Javelins. No, not Javelin. I'm an idiot. <laughs> Why did I just load Javelins? Oh god, did I just... Mm. Really? Okay. Wait, I'm missing 50 already. Where, where did they go? I'm losing ammo even, even though I didn't undock yet. There. That one. So we'll start with Nova Rage. Oh, 188 DPS. In the face. Okay, I need to be in a fleet, I believe, for this to work. So I'll fleet myself up. Hello, uh, Sikinos. Greetings. No need to start Tranquil. So Gobsmackinator, Tranquil is just like, if you don't know how to spiral in on a battleship, you might want to run a Tranquil, but then again, <laughs> you will still die when you go to a tier one, when you may have a battleship and still just approach it in a straight line. So I would say starting with this amount of skills, starting in a tier one is perfectly fine, but I wouldn't go tier two for a start because shit can really hit the fan already. Okay, here we are. Let's go ship is ready we have an ab we have a multi-spectrum we're going to warp somewhere i don't know let's go there yeah james says he went accidentally into a tier one instead of tier zero and he just about survived i mean if you're not prepared for what's gonna happen you know you're gonna get owned but i think i'm ready for for tier three let's see so wait how much did the website say i should make Two, two and a half mil? Something like that, I believe. Now, we might even go for extraction nodes, right? Just to min-max the first few filaments in terms of price. Congrats, Fenwar, to your Tengu. Let's hit it. Dark, tier one. First. Oh, wait. <laughs> I was waiting for it. my ship to jump in. That's not how it works. First. I really need to squeeze, get, squeeze the esk at the, at the beginning. I want to upgrade this ship to a probably hawk as fast as possible. To get the tier 2s rolling from there. We'll make some um, money. Hello, Fincia. And everybody joining. This is the first one. And we get... Oh, that's actually fine. Um, Yeah, we'll just burn two or these guys. Oh, is there any... No. There's no extraction. There actually is one extraction node. Oh well. This is an easy spawn. Let's get... Well, let's just get super close and nuke them. They should go down fairly quickly. Oh, the fit is not shared yet. Let me run one and then I'll put it up because... Well, I'll probably run quite a while with these oh, shoes here. I'm not happy with the DPS, by the way. Yeah, you, you see, I cannot, I can actually not hit the guy con consistently. This is real bad. Now I'm closer, though. That works. Holy moly. Oh, this is not an alpha ally. Nope. No column for transversal. Nope. 
I can feel angular velocity. Probably, Trey. I don't need numbers. Tell me that. <laughs> I can see how my shield is doing, and then I will I will know how good my transversal is. Oh, AKA, not AKA. Um, angular velocity is actually the the value you are really interested in. All right, so far so good. First room, check, and I will probably ah. 50 kilometers is quite a lot. It's going to take me, what, 30 seconds-ish? Let's see what's in the main loot. Maybe the main loot is amazing and then I can just skip the extraction notes, right? Hello, Michael Bao. How's it going? Let's give this another spin. Extraction notes. Those are the the other loot boxes that you could open up but they are usually they are not you know super expensive or not hosting a lot of loot this is nice 1.3 million i think we will just leave this extraction note be there that's a good start it's a lot of filaments calm calm dark another calm dark two tranquils all right cool let's go michael bolt the plan is the abyss with a 5 million isk invest. Oh god. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, yeah, why not? Come on, F me. Why not F me right away? Oh, this is fun. Can I kill the Echo before the Cinnable is anywhere near me? Maybe. Oh god. Probably not. Uh, we, need to, we need to grind down the Cinnable super quickly now, otherwise my cap is gone. Okay. Oh boy. Gonna heat my thingies here. Oh, Jesus Christ. This is real bad. Oh, 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 oh. I'm webbed. I'm webbed. I need to fill my shield as, as fast as possible. Oh, oh. This is a very dangerous situation, but the Cinnabolt does not seem to hit me, actually, which is kind of funny. <laughs> What's happening here? Okay, I'm gonna stop heating. This is easy. Why? The Cinnabol is not tracking me, you Fonsui. Can you believe this? Oh, this is great. Love it. Stop the heat. Just give it a spin. Ooh. Oh, this is glorious. Uh, we can stop the heat here as well. Easy. Easy. Just get on top of the Cinnabol. Don't try anything crazy. Cinnabol is down. This is a tier 1 dark tiania okay cool now echo oh boy oh wait Oof. my cap is gone yeah i'm an idiot there are two extraction nodes all right let's go that i actually was a bit scared there uh Safinom, that could be the roots although here's the thing no, I think I want to run the tier 2s in the in the Hawk to, to min-max the ISK I can get out of this. Bit is not shared yet, Michael Bell. Soon. Another 2.3 million, so we will have a good run, apparently. Nice. Um, okay, reload. I want my cap to recover a bit. Also, I want my heat to go down. A tad more. I could actually... You know what? No, 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 no. 65 kilometers. Takes too long. Okay, my cap is fine. Let's go. Room number three. Hello. Day incredible. Welcome to the Wednesday stream. Late. I'm late today, but uh, I can be late with the finishing the stream. I think I can just... Uh, okay, I'll play it safe. We'll do javelin. I will just enter an orbit of, I don't know, 10 kilometers. That should do the trick, really. Could you bring a scanner to find out what's in the other cache? Mm, that's a good question. I, I do not know that. Hello, less is more. Also, do you know if you can scan the extraction notes? Huh. One hell of a question. Never considered that. Uh, Fonsui says that this is Earth proving what he always says about progression in EVE Online. He always says that it's not about money or stuff, it's about knowing things and knowing people. 
and if an established player lost everything they had, they could log on the next day and start over entirely. Fine. Yep. So this is for returning players, basically. What is the effective range of cargo scanning? Yeah, wait, that, that's shit, right? That's the problem there, mainly. I could probably play this risky with my rage ammo, but it's not the time to take risks more than I already do. Oh wow, the guy just hit me pretty decently. Takes ages to grind it down. Does that guy have an armor wrap or why is this taking so long? Holy crap. New colors in the abyss? Not really. Darks sometimes look weird. Well, this one looks really weird. It's more like a purple sort of thing rather than actually dark. Oh well. Yeah, as chaff DPS is super low, right? So yeah, I will not run tier twos with this ship. So the idea is to grind enough isk so I can get a, uh, a hawk spun up, and from there we will do tier twos for quite a while until we can afford a decent uh, tier three um, destroyer. Well, that would be probably the jackdaw, and then I will run tier three solo jackdaw. That should pay a bit better than tier. To Hawk? Then again, I don't know. Maybe. Maybe not. Okay, let's go. That's it. Uh, let's go back to Rage. How much missiles did that make, did that cost? So we lost, or we used about 300 Nova Rage and a bit less than 300 Chavelins. Okay, be, be good loot, please. Keep good loot. Another 1.1 million. This was a really decent first run, I would say. We got a total of 4.8 million estimate out of it. Okay, let's go. Yeah, solo frigate stops at tier 2, right? Tier 3... Uh, Jack does gonna work. It's gonna be harsh at times, but I'm pretty sure I can pull it off. You think he'll get a skill book soon? I hope. I hope. No, I hope not. That would be a bit too good, right? But yeah, if if I get a book, I can go straight to Salt Frigate. Holy, that would be great. Okay, maybe I, maybe I want that. Can you do tier three in a Tech One cruiser? If you, if you, mm, I think yes, you can do that. It's going to be a bit harsh at times, but it should work. Uh, BA Chains, I do not know yet how long I'm going to be streaming today. Uh, again, the little ones are are having two sleepovers, which is great. Now I could be like, yeah, let's go and use the Citadel to fix this damage. But, you know, we will just repair now. Right there. Okay, let's try not to mix up things. Where can I put this stuff? Oh, there's only corpses in this. We will rename the container. Don't ask about the corpses. Uh, 5 million challenge. And we will just put all the loot in there. 5 million challenge. I think I will keep the filaments for now. Well, I have one calm. I need two more. I'm just I'm I'm just gonna use my my five million up before I get other things. So I need two more filaments now to get in again. Let's prepare for this. We have calm dark, calm dark. Now I have three. I have enough nukes. Everything is repaired. We have four point eight million. I could technically replace my ship already if if things really go go badly. So let's go. 
You can don't call that a container, it's a morgue, hello Weasel. VA yeah, James, it is a morgue. RV DX66, thanks for the follow, welcome to the channel. Let's warp somewhere else and run number two. Let's see what that's gonna bring. An abattoir? Are you trying to, to do French on me there? I'm just wondering, wouldn't it be easier to just rig a raffle for you? <laughs> that would defeat the purpose as well here. Okay, I think we can share the fit. It is working even against Cinnaballs apparently, which is sort of surprising. Um, let's go... Wait, which one? That one. Copy to clipboard. While I'm gonna activate this, we'll quickly upload my current fit. Uh, uh, uh. There. That one. Exclamation mark fit is now pointing to the Kestrel I'm currently running. Keep in mind, I have max skills for this setup, so it might not be that easy, depending. Yeah, no, I, ammo is enough. I just checked. I used like 300 each, which is perfectly fine. This is going to hurt a little, but I'm just going to YOLO this. Uh, I believe we'll just go to the loot. Spark needles have to go there, the DPSers, the rest is not relevant. Let's do it. That's a very easy room. Wait, no matter how easy I have a gift for making the things look hard? Do I? <laughs> oh, mm. Alright, I'll just move on. Michael Bao, do you think there should be a better way to organize your stuff other than station containers? It's a mess. I mean, you know, would be cool, but I believe that there are other areas of the game which need some more love. Are you using implants? Nope. Not at all, Pat Noob. Just to fit the modules I bought before is all. Alright, that one's now. Last one. That was an easy room. I love this. Loot is probably gonna be shit. Yeah, I know Sir Garage, but that that one was actually quite elegantly hidden. It, it only dawned on me when I actually got the full sentence there, but whatever, you know, not everybody got that one, I guess. Ah. <laughs> uh. Okay, we got the loot. Let's open it up. 1.2 million, and that's actually NPC loot, so I will get that. I'll get that isk. Let's go, stage number two, ink. Okay, we, we know how this works. Maybe I can even pick... Nah, probably not. They're fast. Once they decide to burn towards you, they're gonna be real fast. Alright, here we go. Let's hope it slows down very quickly, otherwise my rockets will time out. As you can see, my rockets are not reaching my friend. Okay, we'll switch to the other guy. What's wrong with these guys? They're too fast. Let, let me slow down. I think I'm too fast for them as well. Let's just approach. We, I need to make sure they're out of their micro warp drive sort of mode. Otherwise I will not catch them. Jeez, why are they not? Okay, now. Now they're slowing down. Sort of. They're so freaking fast. Jesus Christ. My rockets are like, nah, I can't catch you. Okay, well, you know what? I think I need to... pilot here a little bit. This is so annoying. Okay, gotcha. Now we'll do the same again. Oh, okay, you fucker. Maybe I should just sit still. I'm gonna sit still. Let's see if that works.
I don't I don't want to use javelins against these. Okay, now I'm hidden. I'll just sit still. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Missiles are chasing the, the tur Oh man again? I should have brought that web, right? Holy sh this is so bad. Wait, I'm gonna go javelin. You know what? I'll I'm wasting ammo here. Let's do javelins. This is not working. I should have brought up a, a range kind of thing to help me out here. Tractor computer. Tracking computer, that is. Okay, now these should work. Yeah, they definitely arrive. Beautiful. Okay. Gotcha. What an a-hole. I can probably even approach the loot now. I'll click killing the other guy. You generally go from a Kestra to a Hookbill. Ooh. I mean, we could do a step in between the the, the hawk, but we'll, we will see. It really depends on how the drops are going to be. In the meantime, we'll decide based on that. If if I only acquire Isk very slowly, I might just just go for a hook bill. Could be interesting to fit a hook bill, anyways. So Fonsui, you know, that, that might be a thing for, for people taking it a bit slower, so that's why I'm considering it as an option to just have more fittings sort of created throughout this little experiment. At a range rate, yeah, that could that could help. I believe I'm good with cap generally. So I I whoa, one point two mil, nice. So I could just you know what, there's uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna open up the this thing there, the extraction node. A little bit more isk would be great. Distraction. Thanks for the wiggle. Is the goal a Gila or why start do we start with a with a Kestrel? I believe goal is not gonna be cruiser even, Camro. I will run tier three or uh, destroyer. And from there I might dual box tier four destroyer. So this is not necessarily limited to one account what I'm doing here. We'll just see how I feel like. I'd rather not end up in a gila. That's that's gonna be boring. Wait, what? Okay, three hundred thousand disc. And the other one is close by, so let's get that one as well. Hello, alien. Hope you're doing fine. What do you mean? Too formal? Oh, it's okay. I I call people sir as well at times. You can test that one MNAB upgrade. What? Not sure what you mean. Oh, wait, did I get a mutaplasmid? Oh, I got a mutaplasmid. Yeah, we, we could work on that. Or with that. This AB will be with me for a while. Another 100,000. Ah, since we're here. Come on, let's open the third box. So I got another almost half a million from the extraction notes, which is great. But, you know, costs quite some time, as you can see. I should go dual prop micro warp drive to pick these up, right? Paul is always world domination, DM Disco. Oh, we are in tier one alien cargo. I only start I, I wouldn't start in tier zero. Tier zero is not gonna make a lot of isk. And Oh. Uh, yeah, tier zero is if you don't know what to do when there's a battleship on grid. We know how that works, so. Okay, 23,000 disc. That is actually not a lot, but so be it. You think it's worthwhile to always get the nodes in room 3? Yeah, I mean, you know, I it's a tier 1. 12 minutes left. I don't expect to get screwed time-wise in the next room. <laughs> Does, doesn't Project Discovery give you more ISK power? It does, Veli, but it does not give you any, like, piloting skills, right? And it is that there's a limit to it for each day, right? Tier zeros are very relaxing, says Sir Rush, and you can run them quite fast. So the discrepancy between tier zero and tier one is less than you might think. Well, again, I'm doing this for 
also just to harden my skills, right? Not just, just the isk itself. Okay, three Lancers. That's actually going to hurt quite a bit. Thing is, they will go down rather quickly. So let's get into an orbit and end their sorry presence already. And yeah, there's no chance to get a bonus in, in Project Discovery either. <laughs> you will not have this 50 million isk skill book drop, right? Oh my god, really? Do I have to approach? These guys are so fast. Yeah, approaching is is the way to go here. This is actually hurting quite a bit. Plus my shield booster is now sucking my cap dry without doing too much else. What is the dark side effect? So dark is going to make you 50% faster and has a turret optimal range and fall off penalty of up to 50%. Uh, yeah, no, of up to 70% in, in the higher tiers. Right now I have a 30% such penalty. That's for turrets. Well, so these guys are having turrets and obviously a hard time. Tech, oh, what, what we can say is that Dark Abyssals need less tank, generally, than any other Abyssal. Because things are not going to hit you as hard. Or at least have the potential to hit you way less, unless you just, I don't know, make huge mistakes piloting-wise. Right, let's kill the last one. Ooh, there are three nodes in total. Oh wait, NPCs are not using their max velocity when they orbit you, so they don't get the speed bonus when in orbit. I see. Okay, let's go and open nearby extraction nodes first. We have still some time, and I believe it's worth it. Filaments are costing me almost 60,000 disk an entry. Actually, let's go here. I'll pick up this one and the one behind the gate. The others I'll just leave. This is a tier 1 Louise indeed. Is a MOA a good chip for abyssals? Is MOA missile or... Or guns? If it's guns, I wouldn't say MOA is a good idea. Medium hybrid, yeah, I wouldn't, I wouldn't do MOA. 1.3 mil, alright, that's something. Now let's go down. This was even better. Was it? Oh no, not yet. Not yet. The previous one was a better, better run. Let's see. Oh, I really need to add this to my overview so I can click there. Alright. Yeah, hybrid, hybrid turrets just suck because they are too low range generally. In the abyss, that is. Okay, that's it. Let's go. Made a bit less than with the previous run, but still happy. And I got a mutoplasm. It's 4.7 mil. Oh, no. Wait. This is a tad more. All good. Let's go. That was run number two. I th I will should I should I roll my AB? Yeah, they they're just buying this for three thousand five hundred disc. I'm not gonna not gonna dump it to the market. Yeah, we roll it for the entertainment value, right? Okay, let's go. If it breaks, you just buy a new one. Yes, it does. I, I can do. Easy. They are... The enduring ones are super cheap. Now, I need to... I have a lot of crap here. Where do I put this? Can I just grab all of this? Put that there? Yeah, that worked. Okay. So, I can actually put my stuff... Okay. One by one first. Enough nukes for another one. We will put that into the 5 million challenge. We got 9 million already. 
Um, and I'm going to mute a plasmid. My AB. Let's see how that goes. Wish me luck. Boom. Activation cost. Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah, I bricked it. Shouldn't have listened to you. <laughs> All right, that was that was a fail. That that was not good. How can I close the window? Escape. Maybe. No. Shit, I forgot. How do you close this again, Fonsui? I'll, I'll write that like that. Okay. Yeah, that's a brick. Goodbye. Uh, we could reprocess it, right? Yeah, yeah. Look at that. Reprocess. We 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 are making some money out of this. Sell these items. 3,700 disc. It's going to pay for the new one, I believe. So we need a 1MN during. Yeah, that actually paid. <laughs> I, I missed positive with this little, little trade there. Cool. All right. Put it on. Done, done, done. Any repairs? I don't think so. All good. Uh, do we have some oh i got two calm dark filaments nice meaning i have to only buy one hello did that work i don't know doesn't look like it now we got it run number three three is good three is gonna gonna do good things um after this i believe i want to upgrade some of my fitting already i i can afford a a tech two mute uh tech two multi spectrum. And and maybe a I don't know, should I go for a tech two battery? Probably not. Tech two battery is a little bit of a waste. I'll end up with a faction one anyway, so I'd rather not go tech two. Yeah, tech two hardener is, is probably the thing that helps me most at this point. How did you change the color of the windows? Uh, you go to general settings and then you choose whatever theme you want. Okay, there we go. Let's go in. Number three. Coming up. Yeah, I would... Again, the Tech 2 Muta... Uh, Tech 2 Multi-Spectrum is absolutely about tank, so that makes a lot of sense. We will upgrade that after this run. Ah, uh, only Omega accounts can change the theme rate. There you go. Ooh, spicy. We got a battleship, and that's going to take a while. Should have brought some EM missiles, but hey, <laughs> maybe next time. I'll pick up the loot first. Hello, Dark Side. I'm doing fine. I was just a bit late from work. But I can run the stream later into the evening. We'll see how I feel about that. 700,000 disc. That's not great. Okay, let's... um. Where's the battleship? Okay, there. Okay, this guy's actually orbiting the battleship. Let's, let's remove him first because that's the guy sort of hitting me. The battleship is not really gonna, gonna hit me, but wow... I'm not. Oh wait, it's almost dead. Yeah, let's kill it. Okay, it's, it's gone. Do I have rages? Rages loaded. Rage loaded. Oh, this is gonna take a while. Holy crap! Oh my god! I hope I have enough missiles, guys. At this point, I'm worried I don't have enough missiles. <laughs> okay. Oh, that's gonna be interesting. Jesus. Yeah, we'll see. See how that goes. Overheat? Nah, overheating is going to use more missiles. Or does it? Yeah, well, it will, but it will also do more damage per shot. But I, I don't think it's, it's warranted at this point. It should be good.
Oh yeah, shield is... Should have brought some EM for this situation. I'll, I'll bring EM missiles. To chew through the shield quickly. Armor is going to be better, but I believe they have a shit ton of it, so... It will take a while as well. I'm going to go at least through three reloads here, right? Wait, launcher overheat is only a rate of fire. Okay, yeah, so that, that won't even help, right? If I had more range, I could open up some, some loot containers, but... Game says nope. So we stay here. You can do the drawing minigame for extra isk in the meantime. What's that? You mean the a project discovery? No, no, no. I want to do abyssal only. I don't want to do anything to speed this up. Again, project discovery is a limited amount of isk per day. Even if you're Omega. We, we will not pollute this experience now. But you're right. Technically, I should just open up the, where is it? Activities? Project Discovery. Click through these things and make more ISK, but that's silly. We will we'll not do that now. Gosh. Halfway through armor. Okay, we're, we're getting there. My application is... Ah, oh, wait. Shield is recharging a little bit. That's why some of the shots are, are less. Thanks for the wiggle. I actually really like the fact that you can have some of these jackpot skins with a login campaign. It's pretty cool. So you you might as well end up with a casino skin eventually. All right, now we are hitting structure, which is the same resists all over the place. Do I have how much missiles are left? 700. Yeah, I think we're good. This is the second room, right? Yeah. Or no, it's the first room actually. Oh shit, this is the first room. I hope I do not run out of missiles. I just learned something. Do not want to go in with only 1,200 here. So it's only the purple skins that could could jackpot, right? Epe's got a purity of the throne skin. Yeah, me too. I actually got that for for one of my alts today. Thanks for the follow. Aino gaming. Aino gaming spot. Welcome to the channel. Is there potential for an explosion? Uh, I mean, if I run out of missiles, well, I still have javelins, but... Phew. If I have to fight a Triglavian cruiser spawn with javelins, that's probably not gonna happen. They'll just rep each other too hard. But oh well, we'll see. I, I think I have enough. If I don't meet another battleship and then a shit spawn, we we're fine. Oh, reload, let's go. I might have to ram the other NPCs. To push them out of the boundary. Uh, that's fine. They will go down. Wow, that's gonna hurt, though. Jesus, that's gonna hurt. That's a lot. Uh, I'm gonna turn around here. I'm not... I'm not sure about this. Six of them hitting me in the face? Oh, I'm not sure that's gonna work. Wait, did I... It's, it also gives me an opportunity to use Javelin, which is amazing. Oh, uh, now I'm too fast. All right, let's 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 stop the ship for a sec. There we go. Turn it on again. Could have just... Wait. Oh, there's a thing. 
go closer to this deviant tower. Oh man, now I'm getting hit. Uh, I'll, I'll still use the javelins here. Ah, uh, this is nah. Let's just go to the loot. I think I'm wasting time here. Not necessary. It's all good. Um, these are a bit far away now. I have to wait for them to get closer. Otherwise, I will waste missiles. Let's get the loot. They will certainly join me there. Oh, now they're closing in. Cool. Feels a little bit like heavy assault missiles here. The swooshing. Wait, really? I need two volleys for this. Okay, then. Loot is here. What have we got? Ooh! Kikimura BPC! Sweet! Why are these guys not getting closer though? They're like, nah, he is long range. I'll, I don't, I don't want. How much is this? No contracts found. Wait, I thought that works. It doesn't? Okay. We'll have to find out once we're outside. It should be a few millions, though. Could be good. Okay, let's fix the shield. It works. My filters are messed up. Okay. Oh, I'll, I'll... Wait, really? How could, can they be messed up? Fine contracts. Hikimura, all regions, all, 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 da 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 da. No. This is fine. I think. I, I don't know. Okay, let's go. Barf just learned, or Urschlag, wait, you just learned missile speed changes over time. Oh, uh, yeah, they, they have some inertia, right? Okay, we're gonna mess with Leshak. It's gonna be rage this time though. So you cannot check contracts in the abyss. I was searching for courier contracts? No, I wasn't. Was I? Hold on a sec. I need to do a drive by looting. <laughs> drive by looting. It's a thing. Oh, and move, move, move. Let's go to the Leshak. Give him a hug. Wait, are they not repping in a tiers one? Interesting. The shacks are big. Can we get a 500 meters orbit? I want to be a bit closer for visuals. Then we do like this. Oh wait, the reason why this guy's not repping is because he doesn't have a body. Okay, I didn't Obviously didn't know that. Um, ah, everything is too far away. Let's go. Yeah, the new combat mechanics, web page and, and video and visuals are really amazing for Eve Academy. Is they're they're certainly trying hard to explain their game. And it might work. Alright, let's go back insta dog. Um so this one here I will just sell. Finding contracts. 
Uh, five, five million, five million. Okay, I'll put up a contract. Oh, wait, in Chita they're selling for... Uh, also five. Uh, I probably put it up for 4.5 to get the ISK fast. So 4.5 mil plus another three and a half, 4.5. I have eight, so that that run was eight million. This is pretty good. Uh, let's move these things here. And the BPC, I'll try to to sell now. Create contract. Uh, next, next. I want four point five mil for this. Yeah, it shouldn't be four weeks, otherwise I'm going to be screwed. Let's do three days next. And up it is. Boom. Wait, what? That was... 120 isk. Whatever that was. Okay. Uh, let's go there. Did I move the other loot? I did. So I definitely need more Rage ammo. Let's buy that. Let's get 2,000. That's 138,000. This guy still have ISK. So once I'm at zero, I will start selling stuff. So I'm still working on these 5 million I, I initially had. This is pretty good. Uh, also, we need another round of Dark. Is there any? Okay. Dark filaments. Have to buy three. Calm dark. Fifty-seven thousand disc. Man, who is manipulating these prices again? Market pricks. Okay, this is fine. Let's. Actually, I wanted to buy the Tech 2 multi-spectrum, right? The Tranquil filaments are actually quite, quite pricey. I'll try to sell these. And what else? Should I sell these? Nah, that's not a lot. That's 10 mil. No, wait. How much is this? Yeah, that's 10 mil. I I, I got some more ammo already, Fonsui. Do you have enough CPU? Ooh, that's a good question. Oh, wait. CPU might be... Oh, this is an enduring one, not a compact. Oh, somebody just bought the... The BPC, so yeah, I don't even have to sell anything. Um, let me check. Can we put in a tech two? I think we can. Yeah, it works. Cool. Tech two, please. Buy one. I have the money now. One point nine mil. Boom. Look at that. We are upgrading the ship. Lovely. This one here, we'll just sell that one, right? What else can I upgrade? I have 2.8 million now, plus 10 million in, in NPC sheets, which I can uh, replace the whole setup with. I think I can't upgrade anything reasonably here. Yeah, no, no more changes needed right now. We'll, we'll just we'll just clock in some hours <laughs> hopefully not too many get the isk and then it is hawk time i don't want faction ammo sir rush that's this point still a waste of time uh, a waste of isk actually this is not for new bros kubatari this is for returning players you come back to eve you don't know what you want to do you don't want to spend all your risk, so 
take 5 million, try to reproduce this. And you will learn a lot of piloting. Uh, let's go. Do you want some EM for another potato battle? Oh, crap. Uh, I'll get I'll get a EM next time. Forgot about that. Let's see what we get in terms of spawns. I would only upgrade modules at this point, which I will sort of transfer into the Hawk as well, I believe. Although, will the Hawk have a multi-spectrum? That really depends. Well, we'll see. Let's make some more ISK and then eventually draw up a Hawk. I, I think we need around 50 million to get the Hawk kind of thing. Oh, this is fine. Uh, where is he, though? Where am I? There. Okay. I'll do... Shall I take a risk? No. Not yet. Travel into these. Maybe I can do a loot flyby, though. Pop some event log... Login drugs. Uh, I... I dr you know, I want to do as little external or other help than just skills as possible. Oh wow, why- oh god. Why am I so close? I don't know. <laughs> because I'm an idiot. <laughs> Shit. There goes my loot. Drive by. Fly by. No. Oh my god. There was your risk. Yeah, these guys, they're no joke. And you have to keep in mind, in a tier one, you will you will not even get a fifty percent turret optimal fall off penalty. I have to work with a thirty percent. That means I I have to stay away a bit further from these. Uh, I can certainly not do dumb things here, as you just saw. I do want to open up the loot box though. I think I can do that fly by now. There we go. One point two mil. Move, 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 move. Ship, please move. Ship, ship has to move. All right, there we go. Whew. So tier zero to three are random. Thirty and fifty. Oh wait, tier tier one can be fifty. I didn't know that. Four to six are random. Fifty or seventy. Isn't it more likely to get a 50 in a tier throw in a tier three though than in a tier zero? I'm sorry, I always had the feeling that this is the case. A module has run out of charges. So Fonzo has been told that the chances are the same. Corbon Axe, this is a tier 1. We only just started with a base invest of 5 million esque, and we want to get up to tier 5. I may or may not limit this to one account, maybe it's going to be two accounts, or even three at some point. But it will be tier 5. Today's part 1. And we are having, what is this, probably about 15 million at this point already. Starting to upgrade the ship a little bit. On the next big step will be a hawk. That's the plan. Maybe I will I will make a, a step in between with the the hook bill or so. All right. So that. Oops. I should have switched to rages. This is a tier one, Joachim. What have, oh god. Oh wait, it's a, it's a Karen. Okay, she's gonna go down. A bit quicker than other things. Uh, oh, I'll try to pick up the loot. So 
I don't have to go back here again. That should work, actually. Don't waste cap first. Oh god, let's pick it up. Boom. Alright, that was shitty. Let's move, 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 move. Kind of pump the stand still here. Karen is a heavy hitter if she hits you. You usually get wrecked at 11 kilometers by the Tesla Grip when orbiting. What kind of weather do you fly, dark or white? What I just did with that Tessera, you can only do in darks. Don't do that. You should be at 15 plus in other in other weathers to not get wrecked. Oh uh, yeah, there's a progression plan. Corvinax, I, I might go to the Hawk right away after the Kestrel, or maybe I'll take a hook bell after the Hawk. It soon after the Hawk we will actually end up into in a Chack Doll, and from there it is unclear. May, I might even go or I might be tempted to just go solo cruiser with a Cerberus or a Sacrilege or something alike. Or I will I will just fire up the second account and run dual Chack Dolls or something like this. And the reason why I chose Dark was the filaments are rather cheap compared to electricals. And in tier 3 you were going to make... What was that? 15-20% more than in, a, in an electrical, so... The tier is still tier 1, B.A. James. Uh, I cannot run tier 2s with, this, with a Kestrel. Tier 2s will only happen once I can upgrade to the Hawk. So, I'm just hoping for a good drop eventually. In the tier 1 and then... It might be Hawk time already. How much is a Hawk hull? Hawk. Oh, 27 only. So I might, since I will have most of the fitting, I can probably squeeze in a Hawk after I have like 40 million or so. We'll see. I would like to have 5 million spare, just so if, you know, I blow up, I can just start again with a Kestrel. So, I mean, capital building is going to be a thing again, Corbonax. Siege Green happened a week ago or so. Uh, Devoted Knight. Um, I don't think it... Ch oh, wait, it, it has a web, right? Yeah, that thing has a web. I'll, I'll I'll play it safe again. Let's just go into a I don't know, 18 kilometer orbit or something. I hope it will not be able to track at that point yet. It, these are relatively annoying. The thing is, if I go closer, I will get webbed, and I'd rather not want that. Oh, this is gonna take ages still. What do you think, Fonsui? Can I YOLO on this guy? Even with a web on me? Ah, it's... No, I'm not gonna... Not gonna push it. Oh, the knights are trying to kite me. Well, I'm I'm in perfect orbit right there. I think I'm, I will not take the risk. That's a bit... Fiddly. Hello, Fofcan. Welcome to the Tuesday... Wednesday stream, actually. And, uh... I'm late, but I might be streaming a bit longer today since the twins are not here. They are with my wife's aunt in uh, Zurich for two days. I was in just in time for you. Perfect. Hello, God screenings. Uh, you too. Have fun as well. I forgot, is this the last room? This is the last room, yeah. Leave less, thanks for the follow, welcome to the channel. If you have any questions, we are doing fairly sort of basic stuff today. Abyssals, low tier, just grinding a little bit of isk to upgrade the ship. So if you're interested in, you know, progression you could do through the Abyss, this could be something that you're interested in. Uh, maybe this stream will also end up on YouTube. We'll find out. 
Be a change says that uh, somewhere that in one in like 60 runs, you'll have a death room. I'm not. That's that's kind of in a tier six scenario. Be a James, when your ship is not super expensive, it's still expensive though. So at some tier in some weathers, Be a James, you build or you could build the ships in a way that uh, they are still cheap, but they will eventually die. So you will not get out of the ships all the time, but you will still be as positive if you balance it uh, right. This might be what you were getting at, but death room. I mean, if you consider the the shipyard in a tier five a death room, yeah, that could be a thing. But there, you can just leave. You don't have to play it, right? This bastard of a ship killed your Punisher. You're going for revenge, alien? Hit it. Oh, vagabonds are very capable in tier six. Uh, what was that? Gammas. I'm not mistaken. Or was it... Yeah, I think it was. Dual reps? Yeah, that, that makes sense. Leafless never never did abyssals. It is... I mean, this, this one here right now looks kind of boring, but if you're running higher tiers, there's way more targets, and you will obviously be uh, in a beefier ship yourself. And, and it's all about figuring out what you have to address first, how you will have to pilot in the first minute so, or so to not just go down. Uh, and I like this kind of riddles. It's uh, also a very okayish paying environment, really. So when can we expect tier six triple box? So my goal here is not tier six, really. I'm uh, probably will will just be fine with tier five. We'll see. All right. Finally, that guy dies. Let's hope for good loot. This, this run so far was pretty shitty in terms of loot. Yeah, it didn't get better. Okay, that one was a bust. We made an estimate of 3.6 million. All right. Solo frigate require three filaments, yes. Well, you know, if you want to run a frigate abyss, you can bring in up to three frigates. Doesn't matter how many you bring, it's always going to cost three filaments, though. Destroyers is two filaments, cruisers one filament. But it's still way better or way faster to run tier one in frigates rather than uh, a cruiser, right? And well, with five million, I couldn't run a cruiser anyways. Lieutenant Tomahawk, thanks for the follow. Welcome to the channel. Uh, and yeah, seriously, if you have any questions, there's a lot of experts in the channel in regards to the Abyss. We can also talk about higher tiers, fittings and whatnot, while I'm casually farming the Sky Need to upgrade this setup. I hope we will be there in roughly an hour or so. We'll find out. Uh, wait, that goes here. I, I need to buy some Javelins now. I don't know, 2k Javelins. is fine. And filaments I probably need as well. What have we got? Yeah, I don't have any tier 1 dark, so let's do that. Dark, calm, 3. You know what? In fact, I could probably just buy 6 this time. And we'll do 2 rounds. There we go. I don't think I heated anything. Did I? No, I didn't. Oh, EM, EM missiles for the battleship, right? Uh, Mjolnir something. Um, Mjolnir. Mjolnir. Where are you? Mjolnir Rage rocket. That one. It's by a thousand. It's going to be fine. So I did remove all the ESC I had on this account when I started. Well, except for the 5 million. And we're keeping track that way. So yeah, ra Rage Ammo is, is close. And Javelin is long range and I believe a bit better application. Faction Ammo will be something in between. But way better application. 
Uh, let's go here. Morning, Trixotis. Ezinim says he believed his Gila was unbeatable in tier 6. High grade implants, 2 billion Gila, perfect skills, running drugs, wait for cap after every room. Do everything right. He was proven wrong. I mean, tier 6s, they can spawn. Oh, shit shows like... Like there's no tomorrow. The, the thing that keeps you alive in in the abyss, or the thing that is most important in the abyss, is knowledge. You you obviously need you know. If it's a, a hammer abyss, you need a hammer. Otherwise, it's not gonna work. But if you do not have knowledge, it's not gonna end well. Oh, this is a. An angel spawn, but these guys actually suck, so I don't, I'm not really worried. <laughs> it's just the E-War guys. Um, oh, they're all, they're already here though, so I'll see if I can just approach and kill them like that. Wow, they do way more damage than I thought they would. Interesting. I was wrong. That sword spine is down, so let's kill Medusa now. Or my cap is gone. <laughs> it doesn't even take a neuter in this room to... to shit on me, apparently. So I'm not exactly cap stable with this. Oh boy. Alright, Medusas are actually the heavy hitters. They're smashing like... crazy here. Okay, but it's a quick room, so all good. Cap stable is a myth, right? Cap stability is for AFK pilots. You need a certain... Well, depending on what you're doing, you, you obviously need cap stability or a certain amount of gigajoules in excess to account for what's, what may happen to you. Generally, cap stability is not really... The thing you're looking at first, especially when you're doing frigate abyssals, seven hundred thousand disc. Wow, it's getting worse. I feel like this was so bad. Let's pick up a extraction node. I want to have at least a million from a room. Oh, my DPS right now is one hundred and eighty-eight. Cold, and if I'm really shitting my pants, I can get about two hundred and twenty out of this. Axie wondering, what do you think is better isk-wise for solo frigates? Very fast tier 1s or much slower tier 2s? How much slower are we talking, Axie? <laughs> we can check uh, that little website in a moment. That's actually a good question. So, hold on. We will investigate this. Let me bring it up. Uh, where is it? That... Uh... That one okay so if you go to a bit well this thing sort of i'll link it in chat an overview let's say you were doing a tier one uh dark 414 million isk tier one dark you will get at least that and then let's get a tier two uh, where was it? There. Tier 2 agitated. So 4.14 million. 9.84. So you get more than double the ISK. Now, unless it takes you double the amount of time, this is better. That's fairly simple. So tier 1 in 7.5 minutes. Tier 2 is in like 15, says Axie. So, it in it, it would I would say in that case you know just chill tier ones if it's double the time for tier twos, that's what I would do. So on the higher tier you you get more lucky chance for drops. That could be a thing. Then again that's that's taken into account I believe with these with these numbers here. Oops, man. 
I love hiccups. No, I don't. Oh, is this Warden will go first, then Firewatcher, then Escort. Warden's gonna wet me, Firewatcher's gonna nuke me. Escort, I believe they do some remote reps, but not super significant. What's my... Yeah, okay, wow. It's hurting me. I believe this Abyss NT link there is showing you the loot, including, you know, the, the good things you get once in a while. Uh, I need to kill that Fire Watcher now. Don't want my cap empty. You're missing the DPS counter. Yeah, that one is not ready yet on my new machine, but it will be. It will be there eventually. Oh yeah, let me mention the cool thing about this stream. It's less than 200 watts in terms of production energy used. That includes my screens, my light, OXLR. Oh, uh, yeah. And the gaming system as well. <laughs> Surprisingly, that is all included. These things actually hurt quite a bit. Dang. Okay, let's go. That's room number two. If the castle were not a choice, Gaurav, wondering which other tech one frigate would you go for? Ah... Uh, Punisher, electricals, that's the only thing I can come up with. One point two mil, that's a good draw. Oh wait, what is this? Decayed Oh we got another afterburner roll. We'll try that. So the Punisher is a monster in tier zero and tier one electricals. Problem there filaments are a bit more expensive. How did you achieve such a low power consumption in the PC? Uh, the PC actually is a very powerful notebook. That's why we got a car in here. So I'm going to get the loot picked first. Yeah, James wondering what's your worst Eve experience? My worst Eve experience. Wait. Thought I opened the loot box. What the Oh my god, Karen's gonna shoot me. What did I do? Pretty sure I said open loot. What was my worst Eve experience? That's a kind of a hard question. I mean, I can tell you the dumbest or but the worst. It's a game. I'm usually having fun. Powe po po Tenzo says his worst experience was joining. <laughs> Terror Destroyer 5K. No, there's actually another. Let's not let's not talk about. It. I have a solution to the problem. It will take a bit longer, but uh... yeah, let's not get into. People are getting upset. But he banned me now, so just FYI, he doesn't like me anymore at all. He didn't want to talk to me though, so is that? So where was I? What was my what was my worst Eve experience? It's, it was actually not in the game itself. So when I was at my first Eve meet, I, I happened to agree to do a presentation, player presentation. And I tell you, it's not the same thing to stand on a stage, you know, with a bunch of people who are there because they're there, not because they, you know, watch your stream. 
Ah, you don't know them, right? Uh, yeah, that's different. <laughs> I mean, they were great, right? I, I just sucked. That, that was the thing. That, that was probably my worst EVE experience. It wasn't in EVE itself, though. No, it was I, I mean, when I forgot the rapper, that was hilarious. That's not the, a bad experience. It's sort of a bad experience, but... Man. Running the abyss and missing a module... Mid mid first room, that's that's hilarious. <laughs> I wouldn't call it a good experience, but it certainly was was not the worst. Okay, Karen is down. I'm actually gonna snag a little bit of an extraction node since we're here. Sort of close to that one. Call to action is Akrimo's for, uh, worst one. Waiting five hours and nothing happened. Okay. What was the topic of your, your speech? I mean, the topic uh, wasn't... I had a really shiny presentation and whatnot. Uh, what was the topic? I, I, I Yeah, it was... It was about the abyss in a, in a mode as in... Do not use the gila. Don't use the gila. <laughs> sort of. I may still have this this thing. I could show you that uh, presentation. I did loot the can, yeah. It didn't have anything in it, I believe. No, it did. It did. Oh, did it? I, I don't know. It's empty now, so we'll just move on. It had nothing in it. Oh my god, that's what happened. I'm feeling bad about this. Are you responsible for getting the gil unearthed? Mm, no, I, I just said don't don't use the gila. <laughs> it's way more fun with other ships. It was it was kind of at the beginning of the abyss, if I if I'm not mistaken. I'll try to find that presentation. I will show it to you. Oh, why the hell am I warping there now? Oh, wait, I can do another run. Let's do another run. How much is this? 4? 3.8 mil. Yeah, I'll do another one and then we will dock. Changing location makes sense, right? Calm dark. Uh, Is this the... F That's the fifth now, right? I think it's the fifth one. Shit, I should have kept track of this. Let's go in. Alfonso is tuning out when people pronounce Gila wrong. Okay. Let's call it the dock. Strike. Okay. We know that room. That room's easy. It is just a little bit of a... Fifth. Okay. They might actually come closer this time. Let's see if that's a thing. Just need them to stop. So my missiles can actually reach him. Okay, I'm gonna stop my vessel here. I seem to hit him, so nice. You wanna you wanna call it killer? Oh my god, Bonsi. Oh man, and I'm... Ah, oh, screw this. I, I really need, I don't know, a tad more range or a web for these fuckers. They are so fast. I think they are not even in their normal orbiting here. They, they're re still using their micro drive because of the penalty messing with the AI, sort of. Emotional only uses the Gila for the Abyss. I mean, it's a really chill Abyss boat, right? It's still a very good tool. Probably the best tool overall for certain solo cruiser abyssals. 
you have so much freedom with the Gila in terms of positioning, thanks to your drones. Makes a lot of situations way less spicy than they otherwise would be. Um, let's actually approach the loot. Yeah, my dark abyssals look very purple today. wonder what that is. Come on, I need a jackpot. Jackpot. Not that one. <laughs> 1.2 mil, alright. Not a jackpot. Thanks for the 100 bits. Uh, Acrimo, I am seeing chatbot and the bits coming. Oh, uh, wait, is that a thing? I'm not Rushlock. We'll leave it be. Thanks for the for the bits. There's a dinosaur. Just because. There we go. Oh, oh, this one. Yeah, thanks. Emotional. That that's the chatbot sound. Spark needles. Uh, I will. I'll keep them at range for a bit. Oculi. <laughs> With another 100. <laughs> Thanks for that as well. Let's walk in 200. Oh, animation didn't happen yet. That one from Oculi. Thanks for the support. Okay, keep a range now. Uh, that one is in range. Man, their, their ranges are so inconsistent. Whoa, okay. I mean, I'm not going to die in a tier 1, right? Thanks for the 5 gifted subs. <laughs> Emotional. That is very kind. Derefin, and thanks for your resub. 8 months of support. So that's a walk-in of 6 subs. Let's do that. I'm going to get into the loot. You triggered the mayhem, Acrimo. Yeah, we, we will blame you. Wait, did, did you complete a level or something? Uh, God, too many windows open. You know, this this is actually costing additional what? On the, for the stream. It's this sort of stuff. <laughs> Doesn't show? Doesn't show. Hype trains are no longer a thing, apparently. Wait, what? Oh, there it is. Oh yeah, you completed the level. So, we're going to spin a wheel. Thanks for the support. Much appreciated. One spin confirmed. Jethros, thanks for the prime. Taking money from Jeff. That's, that's, that's what it is, right? Oh wait, there's another thing I haven't killed yet. That stage took longer because of you. 1.2 million, that's a good one. Let's go. Shield is almost completely fixed. And... Rage Missiles next. Is this the last room? I think it is. Alright, strike grip. I'll just do the chill version for this. Orbit 15. Javelins. Let's go. Man, why is the dark abyss so bright? <laughs> what the hell? What's this? Did they change the lighting in the Dark Abyss? Yeah, I would not call that dark. Oh, maybe it gets darker the higher the tier. I haven't done these low tier thingies for quite a while. No darkness without light, I know, right? Drake's forgot to turn on dark mode. But they're probably wasting the energy I'm saving. I also feel like it looks less... Did they remove some sort of nebula stuff? I don't know. Looks weird. 
Oh well. Is this this is the last one? Oh, I'm actually gonna be close to some of these extra caches. Okilai says that darks are his favorites for the effects. Really beautiful. I like the blue ones, the electricals most. You can change the dark light setting under settings, can you? Kestrus is wiggling. The K Kestrus, the Kestrel is wiggling, guys. Look at that. Don't have to do it myself anymore. Oh, yeah, and there's, what, less than, what's that, 30 seconds left? 50 seconds left? I don't know. 50 seconds left. Level 2, 20%. So far, one spin on the boring wheel is secured. Wait, what? What happened? Oculi? If I wiggle, you, you see the chair wiggling, don't you? Oculi. Come on, I want to loot something. You see Mr. Chair being unhappy. And my chair is what three years old now, and you can, you can see it. And the twins are sort of ripping it apart as well if they're in the same room. Uh, let's open this. 1.5 mil, that's not too bad. Okay, two runs and close to 8 million. Hmm. Still, I, I didn't get any really amazing drop. Let's see what my Mutoplasmid lock is going to be with the AB. I'm okay with more PG and CPU, but I'd rather not waste more gigajoules. We'll see how that goes. And we are... Yeah, we have to bring up a wheel. Hold on a second. We can do that. Little giveaway spin coming up. Um, That one. Yeah, someone said, well, we don't know. We, we, we are going to spin a wheel, right? That that will determine if there's a giveaway or not. But uh, thanks for the support. We have one spin. Thanks for the level one completion. And here is the wheel. Yeah. So what can you win? Partner skin, 200 mil. Yeah, some bananas and other stuff. Let, let's see where, where this goes. I'm going to spin this right now. Best of luck. Oh, that does not look good. Then again, so, some some of you might like this price. Banana. There we go. That, that's it. That, that's that's a climax, isn't it? <laughs> Hot top banana right there. Oh, uh, you want a refund, B.I. James? Dang. Hey, yeah, you know, better luck next time. Only thing you're here for, DM Disco. There you go. <laughs> okay, we are looking at 24 million plus two and a half. So 20. Yeah, we, we're getting closer to that hawk. I believe three, four more runs could do the trick, really. Oh, uh, let's do a muta plasmid of my AB. Maybe that's going to be a glorious one. 
we will find out. Wait, that one. Let's see. Mutate. Uh, no. Oh, ooh. <laughs> holy. F I mean, the, the activate activation cost penalty is kind of shitty, but uh, whew, that's a fast boy indeed. Guess I'll take it. Well, let's see how my stability looks like when you put that guy in. Yeah, I believe that's fine. That's workable. It did fit. It's a bit tight, but we are in. This is a very fast ship now. 1,054 times... Well, we will have like 1,600 meters a second now with this. This is good. We'll take it. Okay, do I have some more dark... Calm dark filaments? Let's buy... One, this is two. Let's buy seven more. And after this, I might have enough fisk to upgrade to the Hawk. Let's see if that's going to be the case. I have enough nukes. This is just fine. Everything is repaired. Giveaway happened. Well, giveaway sort of happened. <laughs> Let's hit it. Oh, by oh, I forgot about something. The, the CSM thingy is called IBIS now. The Independent Ballot Imposition Scheme. And we have a logo, sort of, for the Discord as well. So, if you want to check that out, exclamation mark CSM. Uh, we will probably start assigning CSM roles based on form posts uh, tomorrow, day after, something like this. And then just double check with CCP. Um, I'm not exactly sure if we will assign everybody the CSM role who does a forum post or just the candidates that are actually eligible to be on our tickets. Um, I sort of favor the last, the latter, because we want to give a stage to those people and not, you know, those who anyways are in a lot of public eye already. But we'll see. Maybe other organizers or creators have other wishes we'll find out okay in we go this is work man <laughs> it wouldn't be an urshla project with with it without a tortured acronym man i actually find this pretty genius you know you have the ibis which is a very very small underdog ship it looks cute and whatnot and so it is it is a ship name and it is actually the operation ibis is the acronym is, is exactly describing what we're doing right it was a shower idea i had and that should sell it to you emotional <laughs> jesus christ okay let's just move on um <laughs> do you know who to shill for yet uh no we will find that out in a pre-election Sorry, Rush. I have no idea. That, yeah, that got, that got weird very quickly. Okay, lie there. <laughs> Jesus, emotional. Stop it now. Okay. Holy crap. Imagine how. I, I think my, my wife doesn't even know my, my Twitch channel, so I guess we're safe. That'd be weird. Them watching my stream with her aunt right now, the little ones. Yeah, that would be odd. How many rockets were run? Um, about 400 Scops Machinator, unless there's a battleship. Uh, well, unless there's a drone battleship, then it's going to be like 600. These guys are not hitting anything. Glorious. This is the moment where, where my wife shows the in-laws what do you do on Twitch. No, I think she has, she has no she has absolutely zero clue what I'm doing, really. She she just takes the cut and uh, that's it. Foxfire, cheers. 
Dancing bananas. We need we need such an emote. I only have one banana like emote, and it's it's more like ammo. Truth is very important in a relationship. Money counts too. Sometimes you have to find a balance, right? <laughs> Ooh, jackpot! 10 million. There's my hawk. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, this is good. This one's good. Tier 4 electrical filament for 8 mil. That was a nice little job. Uh, sort of, Sir Grush. I have to pay a fee for the silly things I say throughout the day. Oh, uh, wow. Kikimura. I don't think it can actually track when I'm on top of it. But we'll find out. That thing has to go down quickly, though. Well, I really hope it's not gonna... Tra I might... We'll see if I have to pull range. Uh, pull something. I don't know. I should be faster than... The Kiki, though. So I can get an orbit sort off. Yeah, we're dancing here, but it, it it it's out of range. Oh shoot! I have to do approach now. And orbit again. Oh shit! It actually hit me. I just realized. First, you're not an armor tank. Kiki's gonna take my lunch money, right? I have to be quick. Kiki's actually hurting me quite a bit at this point. Eating my resists. Ah, uh, it is hitting me now. That shitter is hitting me. That's almost gone, so. All good. Next up is a Damovic lunch. There we go. Stop the heat. Is there a countdown timer for the abyss? Or how do you know how much time is left? There is this little thingy on the top left. Just behind the camera. That is this little circle here will sort of deplete, and if it's gone, well, you are too. Yeah, 20 minutes for a abyss, or you were toast. I don't know, DM Disco, you have to figure that out yourself. You can find that one tree within the forest. Uh, that was room number, I don't know, two, I believe. It's not the last one. Yeah, your pot is also gone, right? Do not mess with the timer in the abyss. 900,000 disc. Okay, it couldn't be another glorious drop, though. Let's go. I'll definitely have to dock this up. That's twice my setup, what I have in cargo right now. Abyssals were, were absolute genius addition to Eve, in my opinion. You know, you can argue, like, uh, you know, dungeons in a open-world PvP kind of thingy thing, blah, blah. Yeah, sure. There's enough time and or time, or windows to, to actually engage, so. I'm not saying it's perfect, but this is not just easy. It is a, whoops, is a bit much isk, I would say in the multi-boxing high tier sphere, but other than that, Abyss is a real nice addition. And it teaches people to pilot, right? That guy's orbiting the Tyrannos. I'll, I'll do the same. I'd like to kill that Lancer. There we go, now we can. Oh shit, I'm over tanking. And the Lancer is running out of my missile range. Or my rockets. Rude. But we got him now, I believe. Abyssal dungeons are literally wrapped in PvP. Yeah, they are. I mean, there's an entrance, there's an exit. And that's where things happen. And yeah, they're, they're instant content. Like, if... If you don't have a lot of time to play EVE, Abyssals are absolutely amazing. You just, you know, you're like, ah, got 20 minutes. Yeah, let's do an Abyssal. You're gonna be finished after 20 minutes. 
It's not even going to be in, our, in your hands, really. <laughs> After the 20 minutes. You would say it's extreme PvE. Uh, the lower tiers are not that hard. And if you have an overblinked vessel, it's sort of chill, right? Yeah, there's no way your abyss is going to take more than 20 minutes, B.A. James. I mean, in, in a way, they could do this in, in normal space as well, right? And just make sure, you know, you can't bring 10 ships. And then you can still get engaged, or, yeah, have an engagement. Imagine this... This kind of sites in a light version. Or for the new faction PB... P... Thing? I don't know. Greetings, Dog Spirit. Although what really sells it... Oh, the Abyssals to me... Is, is the uh, visual environment. This is really cool. And I understand they cannot do that in normal space. I actually wonder whose idea this was. I want to talk to the person who came up with the Abyss. I want to know how, when, and why they came up with this. What, what was the, the urge? Why did, it, why did they do it? Why did they do it then? I want to know. There you go, Remy likes to mess with gankers. Conduits were more fun, okay. Maybe we get more things like these. 1.6 mil, that's not even bad. Alright, cool. This was a really good run. We get 13 something million out of it. Can work with that. People could steal your loot and they could shoot them in the face. There you go, Skyami. Yeah, I'm gonna absolutely dock now. Not doing so would be stupid. This is Three times my ship value in cargo, so that's definitely a point in time where you want to drop it. Is this enough for for the hawk? It could be. Ah, no, wait. Actually, here's the thing: I will not be able to sell this stuff for the exact amount. It might it might be less? Yeah, it's probably not enough. Uh, I will sell the reports once I know I have enough to get the Hawk Zerg Rush. I only want to do it then. I should sell the other things now to see where I'm at. And then we'll check. Uh, where is this? That one. So it says 37 million. Let's try to get rid of this stuff. Calm. Oh, wow. I don't wait. Calm Dark is what I'm going to run. Let's try to make money from this stuff. Nine million in filaments. Uh, let's see if it's remotely close. 8.4 million? Yeah, that's good. I guess we will do that. Oh. And then I will sell these. Oh, this is actually more. 3.4 million. I do not intend to build vessels, so we'll just sell it. Okay, I got 24 million in uh, in red loot. 14 plus 24 is 38 million. Wait, what? Uh, tw uh. Oh, I already got 38 million. Huh. That could be enough. Okay, hold on. Wait, I can. I mean, I can sell these, right? Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Another 400 disc. You'll buy at sale value? Ah, I can... I cannot really... get any any help in, in that regard. 
These are probably not gonna sell. Yeah, wow, there's people... Wait, what? 2.4. Seriously? People are selling this for 2 million? Why? Uh, how about that one? Yeah, that's nothing. Yeah, that's the same. Okay, this one is 2 mil. Let's see if that works. Trade contract. 2 mil. Boom. We'll see. Okay, so I can get 24-ish million for this. That makes it so I have 48 million. Kali, wondering if I'm doing tiers... No, tier 1s. I'm doing tier 1s. So contracts, you're, you're not selling in the market, Kali. You right-click and create contract. And obviously before that, you just go uh, right-click, find in contracts and, and get an idea what the, buy the buyout value is. And you just put it up for that or a little less if you want to get rid of them quickly. Okay, so uh, let me check if I can build a hawk. So we have this. These are the modules I already have. What did I want to do? Show info. Fitting. Now, hawk is 27 mil. Um, we will take over the missile or the rocket, so this is not going to cost me anything. The rockets are for free. Well, I already have them. How much is one rocket launch? Actually, I'm an idiot. It was 27, wasn't it? 27, 20. Okay, so minus 1.7 mil. Then we have our amazing AB. Item could not be found. Okay, whatever. We have an AB. Uh, what are we going to run there? That one? Battery. This is not the final fitting, I'm just trying to see. So I have this. We would need rigs. How much is a warm, Alec wondering? It's pretty good for Abyss 2. Mm, it's not good for darks, and that's where my focus is, really. So often I'm wondering how much EHP per second uh, I think we need for Tier 3. Maybe 300? As in, um, uh, sorry, it's a phenom. I'm just guessing. What's the end game? Uh, end game could be anything from multi boxing, tech 3 destroyers to sacrilege servers. Along these lines. We'll see where it goes. Okay, so. What's the damage we get out of this? Wait, do we have a kinetic lock with this? We do. Especially in lower tiers, this is going to be going to be working just fine. Safanom is trying to theory craft and test a sub 100 million tech 3 uh tech 1 there's no tech 3 wait tech 3 cruisers cannot enter the abyss there's probably a tier 3 tier 3 cruiser sub 100 million that's totally possible for tier 3 you could you could do that just fine but tech 1 as in just the hull you will use tech 2 modules right Okay, uh, what, what else would we put on this? The tank is already fairly decent. I, I think we, we will we'll just at first take over more of the fitting from the Hawk, as in we'll, uh, from the Kestrel. So I'll bring the multi-spectrum thingy thing, and wow, that thing doesn't have a lot of, a lot of CPU. I think we will we'll spend one of these. Rick slots to get a bit more CPU. I have two mid slots left. Now what would I do with this? What's the range? 13 kilometers. Now that's not fun. I wish I could squeeze in. 
So I th I think what I want to do is just switch to this ship faster or quickly because it's going to make it easier to run the tier ones. I will run a couple more, get a bit more isk, and then we will will prep this for tier two, right? Yeah, we need an EM passive resist to just make it more chill. Let's do that for now. EM passive. EM passive and probably a a, a capacitor booster for now. EM passive. Where are we? Uh, da, 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 da. There. Compact. Yeah, that's not. Wow. It's you know I can I can probably more easy easily fit this in my rigs. Oh shit! Yeah, the prop is missing. Good point. You know what? We probably don't need this. Now we don't need that. I think <laughs> for now. Um. Let's let's just put in a. Enduring Afterburner. Oh, uh, and then... Wait, what? Oh, not a 10 MNR. Jesus. Oh, that one. Now I can get the passive EM in here. Is there a cheap one? Nah. No. Don't want to go faction yet. I'll just put a compact in. And... I think I should I should go for the capacitor booster. I'm almost feeling like with a cap booster I might actually be fine in a in a shit show situation with, with too many nudes. Let's get a cap booster in here. Uh where's that? Turrets launchers. Engineering. Capacitor booster. Medium? Nope. It's going to be a small one. You can just get the compact easy. And I think for now I will just go with the cheap charges. Uh I'm thinking. So here's a problem, Gobs Machinator. When we are going into higher tiers, there's a good chance we will get two nuding cruisers. And these will just empty my cap like very, very quickly. And their recharger is not going to help. We, we need this. I need some cap now button to, to fix the, the whole situation. So if I can cap up a little bit to keep my booster running and my AB for a while. Uh, when when I'm empty, then I win. So I'm actually considering bringing smaller charges, right? Yeah, frigates need an active cap solution. Fonsi, do you think I should bring 50s? Ah, might be a bit small. Max size, you think? That's only one per. I mean, I... I <sighs> 354 DPS. I'll be a tad slower. Still have a rig. Should I go for range? Or more DPS? I want to YOLO this crap. <sighs> DPS it is, I guess. Also, it says ra range rig. Uh, I mean, I had trouble with the Thumb Triglavians, right?
hydraulic bay thrusters. Can I somehow get rid of this? That would be lovely. But yeah, we could go compact here, right? And then I can compact this one. All right, now I got another rig slot. So I have 15 kilometers range. Yeah, the ballistic controls are expensive though if I put meta in Corvax. They are three and a half million a pop, so that would set me back another seven million. I'd rather not. What do you mean web, Sky? I, I just got I just got more range, so I think we're good. Charges cost that call cost money, so uh, I'm thinking about <clears throat> adding an engineering rig for now. Oh, uh, that would be CC, right? Yeah, CC. Uh, I want to get semi semiconductor. If it's small, neuters, this this will help. Okay, we'll do this. This is what I want to do. 35 million, that's enough. That's enough. I have most of the... These two I have, I have these. I have some nukes. Um, I have the battery. Yeah, this should work. Price-wise, this, this should work. So, let's save this. That's the 5 million challenge now in order to oh i have too many fits yay um oh really man i hate this give us more fits ccp can't be that hard okay what's up with all the diamond rats hanging around gates this week so that should be mostly in galenti space emotional it's related to the arc they started being there last week actually already. Okay, I want I want this. Now let's see if I can get the money. Uh, so I need to sell these things. Oh god, what's the closest closest station for this? I don't want to do ten jump, was it? The lane, right? Yeah. The lane. Thanks, Fonsui. Three jumps from Chida. Let's go. Sell this to the lane. Set destination. So if I would, if I would dump that in Chida, I, I would get less Sisk out of it. So we will do that quick trip. And sell these for, yeah, 100,000 disc a pop. So that's will that will give us 26 mil-ish, I believe. Um, let's use an inst undock here. I, I don't want a tornado killing this ship now. <laughs> with with all the, the loot in it. Nice, 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 nice. That was a, that was a quick hawk. Well, okay, it took me two hours and twenty minutes to upgrade from a Kestrel to a Hawk. Could have been faster, but I'm happy. Now I will be able to run the tier 1s like 30% faster, I would say at least. And if I feel super, super good about it, I might actually just run a tier 2 as well. And from there, the money is going to come quite a bit faster. And I'll be able to start blinging. Actually, I will probably... 
not try to blink my hawk too much. It just has to run tier 2s pretty nicely. Then I will use the Isk for the Jackdaw already. For the tier 3 solo fit. That will be a bit spicy. Corbin Axe says the biggest time sink is waiting on the skills to finish. You're looking at like 4 months to play. Um, the way you are in EVE sadly. That, that's... That's correct. So this is not for new players. I mean, new players can also do this, but obviously with the wait for skills. Um, unless, well, if you have a million unallocated skill points, you can speed things up a little bit. Uh, this content is meant for those who come back after a couple of years and are like, I don't know what to do. And I don't want to spend a lot of money trying new stuff. So five million isk it is. And we will witness the progression there. So returning players, or if you have never done any Abyssals, but have some skills, you could try to reproduce this. And again, you can go the, the Punisher route in Electricals as well. Maybe we will actually do this too. So if I have some Isk Spear, I could totally do the Punisher thingy as well. Punisher is super fun. Okay, let's have a look. View market details, and this is where we are going to dump these. Oculi says if somebody is brand new here, we highly recommend the Kaldari Jones videos. It fits for tier 0 and tier 1 Dark Hole. Can you run checks in tier 2, 3 Abyss, or are you better off going hawk? Hawk. So in a tier two, I'm I'm you're probably better off with a hawk. Tier three, you will most likely need the the check. Otherwise, you you're gonna be screwed. The check just has you know way more flexibility when it comes down to shitty spawns. You can just switch modes to be faster or have more tank and that's gonna come in quite handy uh where was i let's sell this 23.5 mil boom you're looking at 37.7 million that is that is going to be my hawk. Perfect. Let's go back to Chitta. Uh, there. No, I'm an idiot. Wait, did they move? Did they move this drop down from here to over there? Looks like it. I was like, where is it? It's not here. Oh, shh. Well, it doesn't matter, actually. <laughs> These tornadoes will not fire on my Kestrel. That wouldn't make a lot of sense. <laughs> Alright, let's go. I mean, Fonsu, if you're doing this long enough, as in if you run a lot of tier 1s and then upgrade to tier 2s and do a lot of them and you're bored, why not running a tier 3 in the small hull if you feel you can master it? I would say, especially a PvPer is gonna be able to do that in, in the smaller hulls without going through cruiser sort of slow boating. Safinom says, seeing how cheap you can do a tier is what he does for fun. That's great. Hello, Mahete. He says, is there new content in high sec 
for the last year or all the content that became profitable. Um, right now there's an event. Doesn't really pay super amazing in high sec, but it's pretty decent in low sec. And there was not any decent or, or any high paying high sec content was there last year. I don't think so. Mr. Ganyakish still remembers the day Pyro lost the Paladin to a couple of tornadoes. That sucks, obviously. But you know, it's a PvP sandbox, so... That's how things go. SNM makes 200 million an hour from the low sex smuggler data sites. That's a good... That's a good income right there. Uh, DED sites are okay-ish, Mahiti, if you get the good drops, obviously. Okay. Next run, it's gonna be the Hawk. Let's see how that goes. So how do we do this? I will I will exit the ship and I I'm going to squeeze all the modules out of it. Uh where are we? Kestrel, where are you? There. What's the option I'm looking for? Strip fitting. Strip fitting. And now let's go for the five million challenge hawk uh, how do we do this I need to buy the hull first and then I can hit fit ship most likely once I'm in 23 million that's a good price I would say for the hawk and we got 14 million left for whatever is missing with a fitting hawk where are you that one sample jump into it fit ship and yes, we want to fit the rigs. And it wants me to buy these. How much is this? How much do I have left? 14 million. Nice, 4 million. Look at that. 4 million is the difference. So I do have 9.8 million left. So if this fails, I can still just with buy again the, the little Kestrel. And we're going to be good. Um, I even feel like I would put on the other... Uh, how's it called? Afterburner. Alfonso says, this is a little frustrating. Apparently there is a big thing happening now, but he can't find any info on the forums. And no one he knows in-game is talking about it or even interested is this story arc dead or on arrival? Um, so, emotional, where, where did you... Oh, thanks a lot for the support, Broken Head. Where did you see this additional rats? Y you might be one week late. We, we investigated these a week ago. Um, they were in Galenti space and some Amar systems. And uh, we... Uh, what is Virch Vendor? Is that Galenti? Or... Give me a faction I know. <laughs> I don't know what Virch Vendor is. <laughs> where is Virch Vendor? Birch vendor is that that's Kaldari? No, wait. Oh, that's an adjacent region. So yeah, Galenti. So if it's Galenti, uh there there are a lot of diamond rats at the gates. Uh they seem to follow the new AI kind of behaviors, as in they have an FC. Um and they might orbit that guy, keep it at range, or chase it, or whatnot. If you kill that FC ship, they will designate another ship to be the FC. They do not drop anything. And uh, Ash was talking about this, I believe, a week ago as well. But there was nothing... 
in addition, right? Uh, yeah, he certainly is talking about the smuggler event. So, so these gate guys are connected to the smuggler event, which is the start of the arc. Um, and I, I'm pausing the event slash arc content because nothing has happened since last week. That's sort of... It. Yeah, you, you're late to the party, emotional reserve. <laughs> you should have paid attention last week. We're already over this. <laughs> Cheers. Uh, Lord Calafoy, greetings to you. Um, where was I? Yeah, can I fit this? The answer is yes. And I could technically sell these, but you know, may maybe I'm gonna blow up. So let's put these as spares. Uh, now I need some some filaments here it is hawk time where's the kestrel now i need to get the cargo hold contents kestrel where are you challenge challenge five million challenge i called it right there that was gonna be trans transferred here nova rage rocket i will need less of these i believe why is it 200 Oh, no, wait. I don't want Nova. I'm an idiot. Right now, for tier 1, I will... Oh, totally go Scourge. Come on. We can do this. I need Scourge Rage Rockets. Let's buy, I don't know, 5k? Yeah, we'll buy 5k of these. And... Some javelins as well. Nova Chavelin. Let's buy 2k of these. No, ah, did I just buy Nova? I think yeah, I did. Scourge Chavelin. I'm an idiot. Already making mistakes here. Alright. Scourge Chavelin. And let's put that in cargo hold. Oh, I need some more cap boosters, obviously. Pff, I don't know, 10. 100? It's by 100. They're cheap. And then I will fill my, my cargo holds more or less with these. 27. Let's bring 20 so I have a little bit of space for looting. The rest goes... Seriously? Ah, uh, it does not fit. I need a bigger container for this. Ah, oh, man. Let's take Duo Jack. Yeah, let's put the stuff there. Five million challenge. That one is something else now. And yeah, that works good with the contents. Perfect. Alright, bigger container. Done. Ah, ship. Done. Let's put Scourge Rage Rockets in there. 300 DPS it is. And I need a charge here as well. Yeah, I'm going to run... some tier ones this should be way faster i can probably just orbit and kill whatever i have super quickly let's try uh, emotional says would it be fair to say that this story arc is mostly in interest of the lore nerds i think it will be a bit different uh emotional i understand there will be a lot more like scope video stuff to accompany the content and towards the next or the next stage there so arcs are supposedly three three stages first one is mystery right now we have no clue where this is going we're trying to find out things there are weird things happening uh, maybe even on a weekly basis i don't know and, and we we just try to investigate that's probably the lore nerd part in a second stage we will have way more information and the game will tell us you know gives probably new sites and and background information in the game with uh, maybe another event progression or whatnot and then at some point 
like the pinnacle of the of the arc we will exactly know what this is about and we will fight for one of two sides and depending on which side wins there will be a significant sort of difference in in terms of what we get will it be you know this ship or that ship or whatever that we unlock so currently most people assume that the current arc is there to unlock a Kaldari Minmatar faction ship line. So this will not just be a lore nerd kind of thing. At some point, at some point we will know which side we have to fight for in order to make something specific happen in terms of which ships do we get first. That's my guess at this point. Uh, do I have everything? I don't know. Let's just go in and see what happens. What is 33% toxic, Hearthstoner? CCP is currently currently waiting for the 30... Wait, for the 33... Oh, okay. That was context there. They want to progress the event once the 33% toxic people... I don't think it's 33% toxic people. I think there is maybe 5% toxic people in EVE. They're just extremely loud and extremely toxic, so it makes it look like overly toxic. And we just need this 5% to go. That's all, is, all there is. I don't think they will. So, that's... They're not going to abandon their their hobby or whatever they call it. They're going to call it, right? I got it backwards? What do you mean, Otsui? Striking Leshak. That's going to be an easy stage. Where is it, though? Wait, what? Where's the rat? <laughs> what? The, the thing is supposed to be at the gate. Oh, wait. Oh, my God. It's, it's just... It's just... Oh, look at that guy. <laughs> what the hell? Is he taking a shower or something? Okay, I don't want to know what he's doing there. Emotional, let's not. No, emotional, no. We're not going there. Alright, whatever. Found the ship. Everything's fine. Let's continue. There's a passion to be toxic? I don't know, is there? <laughs> oh wow, the guy's actually moving now. Alright, let's get the loot. Then we will get the Leshak. Oh. Loot check. One point something billion. Alright, something. That's good. One point something is something. Wait, is it locking me up only now? What just happened? I, I think it shot me. And then it stopped and yellow boxed me and now it's shooting me again. What the hell? The nice gamer is called Care Bear. I, I don't know necessarily if that's necessarily the case. Care Bears don't need to be nice. I think Care Bears are pretty upset when you know you shoot their toys. So not sure about that. Yeah, we are moving up in the world. This is the actual first run now in the Hawk. Again, I started with 5 million isk at this start of the stream. And we are running a tech to Assault Frigate now. Already. <sighs> Quote unquote already. It took us two and a half hours, but it felt okay. Actually, the first 30 minutes I didn't even really do stuff other than creating a fitting, right? What are these weird particles here? I've never seen that before. Looks like... I don't know. Mosquitoes. What is this? What the hell is this? Is this new? And I'm, I'm confused, Fonsu. Have you ever seen this in the abyss? What is this? Are these snowflakes? What the hell is going on? I cannot remember this. Yeah, Planets in the Abyss is not new. The, the backdrop I've seen before, but I have no idea what the hell these dots are now. I mean, they're, they're, they're still here in Ponsu, a ton of them. What is this? Is this related to the event? Is this new?
Come on, guys, tell me. Have you seen this before? I have not. Or I can't remember. Very interesting. Wait, they have been there forever, Fonsui? Are you kidding me right now? Jesus. Okay, then. Oh, whatever. I seem not to be the attentive type, right? Singularity says I cannot enter the abyss with a deck three cruiser. No, you can't. So that's old stuff. Holy shit, I've never seen that before. <laughs> or never noticed it, at least. Interesting. Well, here we go. I got excited. Alright, so yeah, it's just me who didn't see that before. Cool stuff. What have we got? Oh, that's this is fine. This is an easy one. Let's just go for the loot. So with the Hawk, this is so much easier already, right? I don't really have to pay attention. Just go to the loot, kill stuff once it's in range. No specific special piloting required. All good there. All right. Now let's shoot that guy. I have a bit more range as well, which is beautiful. I'm a tad slower compared the Kestrel, but I think it doesn't really matter. Ooh, 2 million. That's good. Oh, uh, no, the Invisco. No, no billionaire yet, but you might notice I have another ship. About 50% more DPS. That is not a Kestrel anymore, nope. Was able to upgrade to a Fancy Hawk. And I still have 8 million left. So if this blows up, I can just rinse repeat. Kestrel, farm a little, get my Hawk back, and then we'll upgrade. Eventually, we will be in a pretty comfortable position. Probably have multiple ships, and then I will also bring in a, a second account. Okay, let's go. That was first tier one in the Kestrel, uh, in the Kestrel, in the, in the Hawk. Man, Fonsoy, I feel like I could do tier two with this. I think it's ready already. Oh, I didn't share the fit for the new boat yet, Storm, but I'll do that in a sec. I'll put up that fit right now. This is, you know, not, not min-max or something. That's just the one I'm using at the moment. There's better tier 2 fits for the Hawk. Exclamation mark fit is now pointing to this little thing. It's very cheap still. Um, calm Dark. I'm, I will run one more Calm. And then... I might actually just dip my feet into tier 2s just to get some ISK fast. This can fail, and then I have to, you know, go back to the Kestrel again, but let's see. Got some Lucifers here. I'll just go to the loot. Uh, Dramel has to probably go first. Echo is super quick though, so yeah, I'll kill that one. Let's do the Echo first. Approach the Dramil. Oh, this performs so much better than the Kestrel already. I love it. Sweet.
Let me look at it. Will I enter tier 3 with this? Uh, tier 2. I think I can do that. Get some money for the ship back first. Sheldon, I can I have the money to fall back on my Kestrel, so I'm actually good. Alright. And maybe, you know, still have a room or two. Maybe we have some check bot. I think tier two is next. Yeah, tier two is next. It's going to be double the loot, right? With about the same amount of time it took me to run the tier 1s with a Kestrel, so... This is going to be good. Take a big mound of Drox. I could actually bring some Drox as well as a... Oh shit situation sort of support. But, eh... I should probably bring Paste, though. Thing is, if I have paste, I'm gonna use it, and then I waste a lot of isk, just because it can. 1.4 mil, that was too bad. Let's kill the Lancer first. That one should go down super quickly, given <laughs> I get him in range. There we go. Alien almost burned out his guns, alright. Yeah, I didn't do a lot of heat yet. But in especially against Angel spawns, I might wanna have some heating possibilities. Wow, there's a There's a speed cloud going on. What's happening? The guy's barely moving. Why? Okay, now we're we're moving again. What the hell just happened? Felt like the speed cloud had the the opposite effect. Very weird. This guy takes a lot of time to kill. All right, let's go. Yeah, I'm not in an armor fit. Why can I not see the speed cloud still? I'm a bit confused at the moment. Wait, what the hell? I don't see this. It, there was definitely a speed cloud, but I didn't didn't see it. What? You take care, Kalku. Thanks for popping in. Sleep well. Wait, I cannot see speed clouds. That's kind of bad. What happened? I'm confused. The texture thing, Fonso, you had nothing to do with... Wait. Character display settings. Wait. I'm confused now. I thought I always thought that's connected to the character dis... Oh, shit. <gasps> Alright. Hold on a second. That might be actually... What? Why do I have this on medium? I don't know why this is on medium, Fonsoy. I'm confused. Ah, shit. These guys are too fast. I'm gonna stop my ship. Hopefully. My... Oh my god, it's getting out of range now. That's oh, coming back. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, let's just sit with the loot. All right, Damavik 1 is down. Oh, I I think if I get a really bad Triglavian Frigate spawn, this is going to be a pain in the ass. Ah, 
I, I want to get out of the abyss before I change the texture quality. I don't want my client to do weird things and then I lose the hawk because of that. That would be kind of dumb. Almost there. Hello, Twin Head Games. Greetings. How are you doing, sir? Okay, that's it. Let's go. Ooh, I just sold the other BPC, now I got 10 million. Good stuff. Good stuff indeed. Uh, Instadog. Okay, let's change this texture thingy. Hi. Apply. Did that do anything? I don't know. We good? Alinea, yeah, I'm still on. There's a reason for it. First, well, I was late. And second, um, the twins are with a relative of my wife. Well, my wife is there as well. They have two sleepovers, so I basically... I'm single for the next two days. Just saying. <laughs> Three hours to sit in Hawk. That's some nice progress. Actually, it was more like two hours because the first... Half hour took me to create the Crestral fit, right? And then... Yeah, it took two hours to get an Ophisk from the Abyss to do the Hawk. It's a very cheap Hawk fit. It's like 35 million pit. Uh, so to speak, Linnea, so to speak. I, I, no, no wine. Emotional. It's, it's in the middle of the week. I cannot possibly drink wine and we are trying to get a new release ready. At work, so I cannot really do dumb things. Otherwise, I would have been like, how about a, a twenty? Not a twenty-four hour, but you know this. What is it called? Subaton kind of thing. You know what the kids do. <laughs> I would have tried that, but can't work tomorrow. Has is gonna happen, and there's important stuff to do. All right, so this is done now. Am I really ready for tier twos with this? I could push 350 DPS if I have to. Ah, oh, I'm not sure yet. This is a good idea. Normally, I would want to have a faction battery in here. And a faction EM amplifier rather than a compact one. Wait, I have... How much do I have? 10 mil. I got 10 mil. <laughs> Let's get the faction one, shall we? FMC type. 4 million. Do I have the CPU for this? Probably not. Did I just... Ah, oh, I'm an idiot. I do not have the CPU for this. Okay, I can buy a new Kestrel if I blow this up. So I will... I'll take a little bit of a gamble. Let's do it. Alright, so we need agitated dark filaments. They are rather cheap compared. Let's get three of these. Hello, Gomu. I should get paste, right? A little bit of paste isn't the isn't dumbest idea. Then I'd repair paste. How much can I afford to buy? 100? Two mil. All right. Ouch. 
Oh, did I just buy that in the wrong place? God damn it. Yeah, I bought it in perimeter. Ah, oh, screw this. Um... <laughs> Shit. Okay. Uh, we'll, we'll pick that up later. Okay, cool. That one. We have this. That's enough. Nukes. This is good. This is good. This is good. Let's have it. All right, chat. Death incoming. It really depends on on what spawns I get. I'm afraid of Triglavian frigates, the non Vila ones. That's gonna be a shit show. Other than that, I think I can do it. We'll see. Boost the non scourge ammo. Um, well, I I still keep the the Mjolnir. Below this rather quick. Right, let's go. Fingers crossed I get an easy one and a, a really nice drop and then we can start blinging the ship. Oh, I always lose by switching away from Scourge. Okay, well, we'll, we'll get rid of that ammo in a moment then. Alright, let's hit it. I am, well, I clicked the button, so now we better do well. Should I, I should have bought a booster as well. This is fine. I can, I can deal with that. Uh, event boosters I don't want to use. I want to just use things everybody could use slash reproduce. Wait, what's this? No, uh, no. Lancer. Lancer. Kill the Lancer because that one is hurting and he's going down quick. And then I have to deal with the Watchman. The Watchman will hit me quite significantly. Um, Eventually. There's no web though, so... So far, all good. And I think we have a 50% weather. Yeah, these guys can't even hit me nicely at this point. Okay, let's get into an orbit around the Watchman here. This looks good. First room, I would say, is not an issue at all. Yeah, I'll invest in some in a blue pill, I would say, next. And maybe... Maybe some DPS booster. I mean, technically I can also invest in my clone. A couple of cheap implants. Giving me one, two more DPS, uh, two percent more DPS or so. It's not the worst. Okay, Watchman number one goes down. Changing my orbit to the silly Tyrannos there. Uh, but yeah, technically I don't want to really invest too much into the Hawk. As long as it can decently run tier 2s, this is fine. And now I'm... I would say maybe 10 million in upgrades into the Hawk. And after that, the money goes towards the Chackdaw. Then I'll be running the Chackdaw in tier 2s, get more money. So I can probably replace... So I could fall back to the Hawk. If I lost the Chakdo, but then we get the Chakdo tier 3 ready. That's the plan. Man, I like progression actually. It's pretty cool. Now imagine... This is not something you have to come up with yourself. Let's say there is this new... career kind of wheel or the Activity Tracker 2.0 with rewards and guidance. Imagine if, if that would basically tell you to do this, and then you get some skills, skill points, 
maybe you even get a hawk after running 30 tier ones in a, in a Kestrel or whatnot. That'd be cool. Then nobody would have to watch a stream to come up with this. And I believe nobody, or not nobody, unless people would be bored and not knowing what to do because there would be a clear indication in an in-game tool on what one could do. And it would feel like progress, which is great. Man, this skin is way too shiny for for the environment. Okay, what have we? Tier 2, first loot. 4.9 million. That's that's pretty good. Fierce gum offer 2.4 mil. Alright, room number 2. That loot was more than the average I got from a tier 1 so far. The whole thing, actually. Oh, wow. Now we have to work for the money. Hope I don't end up in the blue cloud. Drive by looting and then kill the Twilight Abyssal guy. It's gonna take a while. Oh, God. I am in the blue cloud now. Oh, that could be real bad. Have to get out of there. Pick up the loot. Two point five mil. That's not exciting. All right, let's go closer to the guy. I'm actually already out of the cloud. Nice, cool, cool, cool. What will the check doll fit cost? I have to check. Probably sixty mil ish to start with. Okay, that's gonna cost me a lot of rage rockets here. But so be it. I mean, you will have to use pulse often on. If you're going in with beams, that molar is not going to do anything. And you, you will not be the one controlling any anything in terms of piloting there. The molar is super slow. It's, I mean, it has to be pulse, and I think you will even need a web or something to make it work on the, on the frigates. Uh, the other loot boxes in lower tiers are extremely low value, Sir Garage. And so uh, I don't think it's it's worth it. Fonso wants to show me a fit with the check though he would start with. I'm intentionally not going to look at it because it's part of the content to come up with one. Make some fitting mistakes. Change some modules, make it better. Uh, I don't think we will have a check. Well, if the drops are going to be great, like soon, we might, might we might even see a check all today. Otherwise, this will happen during part two of this little series. And yeah, that's going to take a while still here. Holy crap! What did I just do? Orbit. That one. That one. Dancing. Let's dance with a. The drone bully.
I mean, uh, as in, I mean, you, you rarely find yourself waiting at the gate. Uh, with a short range setup. If you have a Gila, that might be the thing, right? But then you, in, as a Gila, you'll use other means to collect the loot that is far away. I don't think generally that in the lower tiers you're going to pick up the extraction nodes in, in Frigate and Destroyer setups. That's not very likely. Morda says, is this a new stream or is it just today stream hours? Oh, it's just today and tomorrow, Morda. The twins are not at home, so we are having a little bit of a different schedule. Well, actually, I was just late today, so I haven't streamed more than normal. I, I started late and we will we'll just continue a little bit as long as I feel like my voice is good, my attention is good, and you guys are, I don't know, having fun or... Some of you are still here, right? We can we'll keep it running. <laughs> That's the plan. And if you have any questions about the Abyss, feel free to ask. Man, this guy has so much HP! I hate this! That's my th second reload, right? Cheers, Pat Noob. Glad you're taking something away from this. You want to try a rock talk? Uh, so, as Fonsui said, the default for a lot of people seems to be light missiles because, you know, you have way more range, you can stay away from stuff, but... In general, I guess you're even safer in a Hawk. If you know if you know the kill order for, for, for whatever spawn is being presented to you, the hawk is going to be uh, sorry the the rocket boat is going to be safer because it kills stuff way faster that way and you don't have to really worry too much about towers killing your missiles off or whatnot so i like these okay wow that years later Imagine this in a light missile boat would have taken another 30% more time. I mean, busy in... If you have a 50% penalty turret optimal range, you can get them to 10 kilometers, it will be fine, and you could even use the short range ammo there. But we'll see, maybe there's such a spawn coming up. Uh, did I? Oh, yeah, I, I got the loot before the boss. Yeah. Okay, this is gonna be wow. <laughs> All right, um, I think I'll have to deal with these neuters very quickly. Otherwise, this is not gonna be fun. They will they will go down super fast though. At least I'm hoping <laughs> that's gonna be the case. Let's see. There we go. Dissipator, four dissipators, and three lancers. All right, we have a fifty percent turret penalty, so this isn't the worst. First 25% of the nuding power is down. The nuding just started. Let's kill the next one. I have to get into the orbit of the next guy a bit earlier so I don't have missiles timing out in space. Looking good.
This oh, this is the last room. So my first tier two actually took quite a while to run. We'll probably get out with just a bit shy of five minutes left. And Fonsui. That funny little texture thing seems to affect the visibility of the clouds, which is kind of scary. Did not expect that. Anyways, we have the correct setting now, so... All good there. Oh, this is a ghost bird skin, Will Jonesy. Ghost bird. It's the only one I have. Graphics affecting visibility of stuff is important, right? Can get you killed. Two and a half mil. Okay, so my first tier... Tier two... Uh, yielded... Ten mil. Okay, and that took me... 15 minutes, so I can make... I don't know. What was the average again? Let's just run a few more. And get a lucky drop and then... Jack, though, is already... Knocking at the door. Actually, wait. Do I have another badge? No, I don't. We, we are in the Hawk now, via James. Riding up the ISK. I have 10 mil in cargo. From the first tier 2 run uh, is the current states. Next up will be the Jackdaw. Which has to be running tier 3s eventually. And from there I will either go Cerberus or Sacrilege. Or I will go dual boxed Jackdaws. But even, yeah. I should probably do dual boxed tier 3 hawks, right? First. Like, that's more money than dual box tier 2. Wait. Dual box tier 2 hawks. It's gonna be fast. No, dual box tier 3 hawks is gonna be better than dual box tier 3 jackdaws. Gosh, first. This game is so complicated. All right, what have we in terms of filaments? I need some more agitated dark. I do not have that. Okay. Agitated dark station. I'm going to buy two runs next. How's my ammo situation? So I will remove the Nova nukes and the Mjolnir. No need for this. That's enough Scourge, I would say. Ah, I want to do two runs, so let's buy a few more, maybe. Alright. That is good enough. Didn't use a capacitor charge yet. That's beautiful. Yes, something like this. Uh, Safenom. We, you know, here's the thing. We could actually do both, right? If I have an office, we, we can run some servers sacrilege solo, or we can at times run dual boxed stuff with a hawk and the, the, the uh, jackdaw. That could be a thing. If you spend enough on a jackdaw, I can do tier 4 alone. Yeah, that's that's probably the, the wrong progression path, though. I'd rather run dual hawks in a tier 4 just to min-max isk, right? It's gonna be 50% more isk per hour that way. Where is the... Ah, uh, here. 
Oh my god, did I really just do that? Oh, I'm gonna regret this hard. Whatever. <laughs> you, you didn't see what I just did, right? Everybody's gonna think this is bait. <laughs> I hope everybody's gonna think this is bait. Ah, oh, jeez. Ah, oh, sentinel. Whoa, three sentinels? Seriously? Right. Yeah, it's not... No, no, dark is fine. But you... Some of you might have seen where I just opened that filament, and... Yeah, the time is not a good time to do that. Oh god. <laughs> but we, we might have to buy a new, um, jack, though. Yeah, I, I run it on my undock, be a James, that's not a good idea. I don't think I will survive this, so... Oh well. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> oh, god. Have a little bit of a sentinel in the face here. We need to kill these sentinels fast now. I'm running out of cap. This is bad. Things are Yeah, my capacitor is empty now. This this is actually wait. I'm actually gonna die to something else here. I'm gonna wait for one more sentinel sort of mute. There we go. And now we're gonna, gonna kick that off and get a little bit of cap back. Let's oh Jesus. Come on, this is bad. We have to kill that sentinel. Oh god, I just run out of cap completely. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, chat. This is not good. This is real bad. Oh, I was too late. But there, we got another charge. Come on. Ouch, ouch. <laughs> Shit, these sentinels are actually harsh. <laughs> and there we go. Capacitor is gone. Let's kill this quickly, shall we? Holy crap. I need... Oh, man. I really need this. Come on, kill, kill that thing. Oh god, reload. Are you kidding me right now? Is it? Nah, there we go, we got another one. Alright, cool, 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 cool. Oof. <laughs> Shit's hitting the fan. Uh, hold on. Might actually die inside here. No, I think I got it though. I think I got it. Okay, let's stop this. Neuters, man. You can kite the newts into fall off. Yeah, I could, but it wouldn't. It would be half as fun, wouldn't it? <laughs> uh... Yeah, I think I'm good. We'll just wait it out now. Okay, sentinels going down. Oh, I should have shit. I should have used that for cycle. Anyways, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We good. We are golden. <sighs> Capacitor is empty. I heard that a lot now. Historicals. That was something. Nah, it wasn't nice flying RP. It was just making drama. I should have pulled out a range from the newts and maybe killed the. The damage guys first. There was a lot of option there. I didn't take. Ah, oh, shit. I'm an idiot. No, no, no. Let's not waste charges first. Come on. Okay, one. Repair. Loot. Two point four mil. That's not exciting. Oh, I'm gonna fix the AB. Jump. Okay, I have to dive on the tangler there. 
that, that thing has to really go down very quickly, and then the striking, and then the... Yeah, let's cancel the repairs, start shooting. Cannot be webbed for long, so... Wait. He's still locking me, he didn't got, get me yet. <laughs> Shit. Oh man, I have to stop my ship though. I'm not, I'm not hitting him. Damn it! This is, this is so da- oh god. Now, now the Vedmac is ramping up. Uh oh, we have to get that Tangler killed. Come on, come on, come on. Vedmac is not hurting me hard though, so that's good. These things are so fast, man. They are outrunning rockets. Can you believe that? Okay, now let's kill that guy. And then I'll get into an orbit around the harrowing Vedmac, so he shouldn't be able to ramp up anymore. Or, well, hit me for that matter. He will still ramp. I'm too fast. I need to slow down. Alright, 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 okay, okay, okay. Come on, kill it, kill it, kill it. It's gone. Alright, cool. Now let's hit it. Hagu says, nice content, a little drama, and showing us news why we need to kite. Every mistake I make here is gonna be a mistake you don't have to make, right? Okay, that guy's actually kiting me nicely there. I'm a bit worried. I mean, I, you know, I can just go away. Let's go away for a sec. Get out of his range, so he has to... ...to spool up afresh. There we go. Now we dive back in. Where is he? There. So I, I just went out of its range, so it has to spool again from zero damage. Well, from whatever base damage. And now I think I actually got him in terms of positioning. There we go. Staged mistakes, are phenomenal. Ah, thanks for the follow, Arcturus. Welcome to the channel. Not everything is staged. I make mistakes quite a lot. Quarf says, do single weapon systems have an advantage of the others where you can group and ungroup them? <laughs> no idea. Okay, this took a while. So single weapons typically can take more heat. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. The less modules you heat, the better. Oh, yeah, that's why you can heat the Triglavian weapons forever. Also, the, the Zappy Boy kind of weaponry can be hot for ages. That's a good point. Why did that? Okay, there we go. Whoa, that loot is shit, though. Ouch. Alright. Last room. Concord? Oh, wait, that's what I did. Oh, I'm an idiot. Thought I had a, a tick there. Ooh, okay. Uh, I'm gonna play this safe. That is a lot. Oh shit, they're even tangling Damovix. Gosh, I think I can't even deal with these. I have to. Ah, I think though. Right, let's let's kill the, the Tangler. I'm an idiot. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's two of them. Oh shit, no, 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 no. Oh god, what did I just do? Oh, this is gonna be so bad. Holy shit. <laughs> Switching ammo. Oh god, there we are webbed. Okay, this is gonna hurt a lot. Jeez, spark needle strike. Okay, they're, they're different damage types though, so... Oh, let's kill them fast. Uh, let's not do it hot yet. Let's just kill the 
damage dealers ASAP. Oh, I misread that. Really badly. Then again, it seems like my <laughs> my base resists are pretty cool, so... Yeah, well... Let me move some more damage from the field and then everything is gonna be fine. Wow, that was less hard than I thought it would be. So many spark needles, strike needles. Yeah, you, you have to, to switch ammo at least two times there, potato cake, right? <laughs> that was so bad, man. The first 30 seconds was me just changing ammo. Ah, shoot, that dumb reload there. Oh well, so be it. Damavix are repping the thing like there's no tomorrow. They're repping their buddy, but it's not enough. Let's kill the Tangler next. <sighs> so, Safinom, I didn't change damage type. I changed from long range to short well, first I changed from short range to long range because I thought I'm going to pick off the guys. Then I saw, wait, those are two Tanglers. Uh, I will not be able to keep them at range. And then I switched back to to a short range to kill the stuff that's going to hit my face. But anyways, that was, that was bad execution. But I'm still there, so let's call it a win. Years later. Tangler's down. I, if I would have had short range and shot the first Tangler super quickly, I could have just probably get gotten the second one as well in time. I don't know though. Maybe. Hello, smart dog. How's it going? we get good loot actually it doesn't matter i yeah we'll see <laughs> that trace is a bit in an unfortunate place there wait why did that even open at this point at this huh? i'm confused oh well we'll see what's outside when we exit Six mil, that's good. All right, let's hit it. Oh, this is a tier two dark now. Smart dog. We started in a tier one dark with a Kestrel. Five million was the initial invest, all included. And with the money made in the abyss, we were able to upgrade to a Hawk already. In before the, the gates, they're actually not here. Oh wait, nobody is here. That's That's kind of hilarious. Okay, <laughs> so be it. <laughs> Seems I'm gonna get away with this shit. Yeah, do not do not run epistles on Chida on Dock. That's not a good idea. No matter what. Lucky me, I did not lose the shift there. Holy shit. <laughs> so I was using an insta on Dock to get away from the station quickly, right? And then I already spawned the filament because I didn't think. But here we are. <laughs> it worked on grid with 4-4. Uh, how do you actually go about creating an insta, uh, an insta dock? Um, just you know, hawk the station, create a bookmark. Yay, yeah, James. That is the easiest way. Uh, okay, that's the 
anything here. Agitated. Whoa, I got three dark filaments. Okay, cool. So we still have enough stuff. What's my current status? So I got six million left and 30. Wow, already? 31 million of loot. So I don't. I mean, if I would sell the hawk, uh, I don't think I want to sell the hawk, though. I'll keep the hulls for now. So I need another... Th How much is the hull for for the jackdaw? Jackdaw. Oof, okay, 57 mil. So I need at least... 70 mil? To upgrade to the check though. All right, that should be like five runs or something. Oh yeah. So for, for those wondering, what is an insta doc? Let's let's do a quick interim intermission. Um, I'm just gonna use a, a shuttle here. So insta dock was the question, right? So what do you, what do you do? Is it just turn around now, right? Turn around. Just fly inside a little bit until you start bumping. See, so Charlie, I'm still streaming indeed. The little ones are having a sleepover with a relative and well my wife is there as well so there's nobody else here this is this is actually my first night after two and a half years with, without having a crying baby so see now and i'm inside of the station and it just hit Control B, call that insta dock, and you warp there in the future. That will make it so you do not end up in the camp of. Wait, where are they? The camp of these guys. You will not end up here and get caught. Insta dock. Insta undock is you just undock and you bring a ship that has a micro trap and you burn away for, I don't know, a couple of hundred kilometers. In a straight in, in the line in the same angle you had while undocking and uh create a bookmark a couple hundred kilometers from the station and this is gonna be your insta undock total chat says why did Ch check toll price go up while others go down that's a good question i do not know total chance What do you mean, DA James? It is just an anti-clutter thing. The bookmarks? No, they, they're making it so you were not getting... So, if you just warp to a station, using the warp to station thingy, that may might drop you out of warp a bit short of the docking point. So, there will be a window of time, especially when you're transporting valuable stuff, uh, where people can just lock you up and insta-kill you. So, the idea of an insta-dock is to be in docking range the moment you, you exit warp and then just dock up and not have this window of opportunity to get ganked. With the insta-undock, it's sort of similar. When you align from undock to somewhere, that's going to take time. And while you align somewhere, you are not invulnerable. So, people can just shoot your ship up, even in high sec. And uh, with an insta undock, you try to avoid that by having something which is in a almost zero degree angle from your undock. That makes it so, since you're moving, uh, you, you're almost instantly in warp when you're warping to your insta undock. Uh, I mean, we can 
show you that now. Let's do another run with the hawk. Where's the hawk? Hawk is here. Is that the right hawk? Must be. Yes. Filaments. Let's go. So let's use the insta undock and not launch the filament there. That's another good idea. Let's see, I have to practice this. So there we go. Right now we are invulnerable. There is a 30 second timer where we cannot be shot. And we want to warp to somewhere which is in alignment to what we are currently headed. Okay, three, two, one, warp to location. And we are already in warp. You try to close that window of opportunity of being attackable as much as possible with instant docks. All right, let's go to another spot where we launched a filament. I mean, the closer, you know, it is. If, if you do one at exactly 150 sort of kilometers from the station, there might be people waiting for you when you use this undock thingy, so. How's the challenge going? We're doing good, uh, and Jessica. We, we are already in a hawk. Running tier twos. Solo, that is. Let's make some more isk to upgrade to the jackdaw. Uh, striking damage uh, I don't know how this is gonna go down I will just shoot should I just shoot the harrowing vet Mac first I think I want to do that oh no wait they will rep them right yeah, yeah, yeah that's not a good idea let's kill the small things first Ah, shit. Things are too fast. But, yeah, maybe maybe I can do it, though. Oh, shit. Getting quite some damage in the face already. Oh, my God. Some of my missiles are... Fuck, this is a shit spawn, man. This is real... Okay, I have to actually kill the big guy first. I think. I shouldn't have switched. I shouldn't have switched. That was dumb. Let's try to kill the hiring vet Mac, though. Oh, God. I have to disengage. I have to disengage. It's not good. It's not going to work. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's get out of range. We need a reset. Oh, 30% optimal range reduction only. Okay, this is bad. But I'm going to reset the hiring vet Mac. Okay, stop, stop, stop. Stop the heat. I need to dive on that guy so he can't... Wait, am I still... Why am I still shooting? Jesus, first. Okay, now let's try to catch him. Oh, I'm wasting my... Oh, I didn't... I didn't get him. But we, we are at the, the boundary now, so he has less uh, movement options, so we will get into that orbit. There we go. Now we cannot uh, hit us anymore. Cool. Oh, I'm in the wrong angle now, though. He is hitting me again, uh, fucker. Let's kill him quick. He gets a lot of reps, but I think I can break. Can I break through? Jesus, these reps! Okay, I'm gonna heat. We, we need to burn that guy down and then deal with the little shits. That was a nice little hit. I really need to kill that guy now. Holy crap. <laughs> okay, it's in hull. It's in hull. Man, oh my god, if that guy hits me again, it's gonna be real bad. I, I need all my shield. Which module has... Oh yeah, okay. Oh god, do I go through a reload and that guy will get repped again? Oh my god, that was so tight. <laughs> Shit. 
<laughs> okay, let's stop the heat. Let's stop the heat. Oh, Jesus, Erst. These are actually dangerous, man. Ah. Oh. That was harsh. And it took a while, right? <laughs> These guys were wrapping it like there's no tomorrow. So the main issue there really was the these three things they they're repping their friends right and that uh repair amount was pretty pretty insane and i c i couldn't kill a small guy quickly because they're kind of getting out of my rocket range now you know they're super close but they're super fast so uh my rockets might t time out in in flight which happened so i can kill them easily what i sh could have done is stop my ship but that's not really an option when a cruiser is ramping up on you a triglavian cruiser <laughs> so i was in a really yeah, dumb situation there oh, man but i solved it it just took me a while to to do the right thing right all right well, now let's kill the other guy <sighs> man Yeah, the hawk is still alive. And I, I did run a filament on grid with Cheetah 4-4 emotional. Accidentally. Nobody was there trying to catch me, though. That was interesting. Unexpected. Alright, now let's go. That was a shit room, man. Pierre... Uh, I need this. Need this on for now. Repair, repair. Let's fix these things. Remy May says the real thing that gives away the pre recorded was running one on his Insta without dying. I mean, you can you can see the uh, the time, right? There are other streams who are doing this, by the way, and they run almost 24-7 just leeching at money, but that's as far as I will go. Oh, wait, I want the loot. I forgot the loot, almost. How can that be? I'll repair this, shoot this, repair that. Get the loot. 8 million, that's a real nice push. I love it. So I'll get at least 10 million out of this run. We're getting closer to that uh, check, though. If I don't mess up in the next two rooms, that is. My loot GM is finally back, the Indisco. Took a while. I wonder what that guy was doing. Probably eating pizza. Okay, what's that? Uh, is a Karen. Okay. Guess we can take that. The difficulty of the filament will increase if you do it with more shit. No, it won't. The difficulty is always the same. It depends on the tier you run. But obviously, doing stuff in a frigate that is designed for a cruiser might require more than just one frigate. So, there's your difficulty increase in a way, right? Oh, let's get the loot. Uh, 2.6 mil. Let's get into an orbit around. Where's Karen? Oh, shit. Oh, wait, they're not repping, though, so... I'll just get into an orbit and kill Karen first. Cannot really approach the cruisers now. They might mess with me quite a bit. So we will kill Karen first. There we go. <laughs> nah, I don't think Swift has time between eating pizza to actually rig my loot. Alright, Karen, and then the cruisers. 
if I were to try to get into range with the cruisers, my angular velocity versus Karen is going to be really shitty. And then Karen is going to hit me, which is not an option. So we'll kill her first. I wonder what these drifter weapons actually are. Are these turrets? I guess. They just have a different... Or, what kind of turrets are these? With the green... effects. Hmm. Okay, there she goes down. So one can say tier 2s are already kind of tough with this setup here. Space boy turrets, not drifter turrets. Maybe, nah, drifters are not chove, are they? What are drifters anyways? Man, we where's, where's, uh, where's Ash when you need them? <laughs> Once you're in the save, can you show us the build? Exclamation mark fit. You can check that out right now. It is very cheap. 35 million worth of Hawk here, pretty much. It's just the hull and a couple of Tech 2 and meta modules. Oh, the way this started today was with 5 million isk initial invest, Kestrel and Tier 1 Darks, and now we are in a Hawk with two, Tier 2 Darks with the aim of getting a Jackdaw financed through this to run eventually Tier 3 in that Jack doll. And from there, we will either go multi-box or cruiser. I don't know yet. Um, if, it's done, if I were to really bling this, I could run tier 3s, but that's not a good idea, I believe. Oh, shit. Oh, I, I really hope I can kill that Tangler before things get real dicey. We'll find out. Right now my rockets are oh, starting to hit. Okay. You know what? I'm going to stop my ship at this point. To make sure I hit that Tangler. Okay, this looks good. Alright, and there's the big boy starting to ramp up on me. I might try to do the same with the, the striking Damovic now. Which seems to orbit the big guy. You know what? I think I have to have to go down on the big one now. It's only one repper, so that's fine. Let's get down there. Ah, oh, shit! This hurts a lot already. I might have to disengage. Damn it! That guy's. Oh wait, I'm actually getting closer, so I think we're good. Yeah, let's stop the heat. Can't track anymore. I got him. We are under his guns. It's sometimes hard to do that when when they're still in their micro warp drive mode. Uh, you will not be able to pull this off. So you have to somehow get them out of that mode. Hello, Shara. Good evening. I did I did loot the previous stage, not this one yet. No. All right, we're just under its gun. If it hits me now, here's the thing, that guy's ramping up, as long as I'm in range, right? But he's currently missing. If he's gonna miss, if he's gonna actually hit me again with full ramp, my shield is gonna be gone in one tick, so I 
have to make sure that it, it does not happen. Or at least not with a hitting or smashing or penetrating shot. Isn't it better to use light missiles instead of rockets? Uh, Frarian, you can obviously get more range, right? But in, in a lot of situations, just powering through DPS-wise, especially when you solo this, is the safer way to do things. With light missiles, you might just not have enough DPS to break through. Especially when you're facing... For worst case scenario, we, you have like five or six of these. They will rep each other like there's no tomorrow. And light missiles will not power through that. Worst case scenario. Rockets will. Alright, let's go. That was... That was it. No, rockets have more DPS. So rockets are the short range ammo. And short range ammo can always get higher DPS than long range. We're talking DPS, not like alpha or whatnot. This is tier 2 Kubitar, yes. What are the new modules that decrease your signature radius? Uh, they replace the burst jammers? Isn't that just the Marauder thing? I'm, I'm confused. Alright, that was not exciting in terms of loot here, but this the first loot was actually really good, so 13.8 million. We can get out of this one, that's great. Armor tank decreases SIG radius, does it, Ludwig? Uh, Ludicrous. I'm not a SIG radius specialist. Halo implants, yeah, he was asking about modules though, Sky. Thunder Child, passive reach and is a is a B says Mango Wink. All right, I never actually noticed that. Interesting. Okay, we save the loot. Nice. Oh, I have enough nukes for another round. Agitated Dark. It is. Now, I really want a... I don't know, I need a skill book and then we can get the, the check though. Let's do it. So Eden Comp ships all have extreme shield capacity values, but how long does it take for these guys to, to actually get there? Catalyst 20. No wait, that guy just burned somebody. So there's the signature radio suppressor, and that's battleship only, says Bruce Malt. All right. No skill books in tier two? Really? Pretty sure I had them there. All right, let's do it again. It's working. Specialization books start to drop from tier 3. What about the normal ones? Uh, what is this? Entangler? Yeah, we'll just kill these first. Get out of the... Why do I not see the red cloud? I'm in a red cloud. I do not see it. What the actual... Everything is high here. I don't know. They, they messed up something in regards to graphics settings lately, or graphics in the Abyss. Maybe that's related to the reflection issues. That's so weird. So specialization books, Fonsui says, drop in all tiers. Everything drops in all tiers, only chance and quantity increases. Okay, well. I'm definitely in a cloud, but I don't see it. What the actual... 
That's so bad. Alright, let's try this. Whoops, let's try this off. Lancers. You have a better time seeing the clouds in potato mode? I'm just confused. I saw the blue cloud today, but definitely not seeing the speed and red clouds, which is really, really scary. wonder what this is. So they were dropping when trick ship's skill books were on the loot table. They have been removed now, says Morda. All right. Did not know that. Okay, that, that's a very small chance there, Ripper. <laughs> we'll not bank on this. Okay, maybe I get a nice Mutoplasmid. Who knows? I'll take that too. I mean, Fonsu, why do you say that they they wouldn't change loot tables without announcing it i believe they do that all the time a little bit <laughs> no okay the, the 0.03 is historical data all right so before the change it recorded obviously the drops there okay so no specialization books well it would be funny if I get one on stream now, right? Bonsu says he was personally promised by more than one dev who would be involved in this change that if it changed, it would be in the patch notes. Okay. They lied to you, Bonsu. Man, has a mean world. Or they changed their mind, actually. That can happen too. So Morda says he did hundreds of tier 0, tier 2s. Tier no specialization book from 100 tier 3s. Oh wait, from 100 tier 3s he got 2 to 3 books, right. Oh well, I mean, let's just check the Abyss loot tracker there. It will probably confirm one side of things. Yeah, I, wait, I don't even see the blue cloud now? What is... what's happening here? Uh, hell. This really scares me now. That is not fun. I have to be extremely careful now. Not seeing the clouds. Was that a change? So the trick cloaks are not dropping since the removal of the sh skill box, says Morda. I broke the game, yeah. Damn it. Oh, what is this? Starving Leshak. Ooh, we need to be quick there. <laughs> We need to kill that starver. Um, yep. Let's be very, very fast. OMG. That guy is going to lock me in a moment and will mute me to oblivion. Come on, friends. We got gotcha. you. Luckily, there's no... Wow. Luckily, there's no Weber. The thing is, I can probably kill him before he mutes the... Before he has another cycle on me. All right, let's go. I hope. That's the case. Well, then again, my regen is actually already fixing the problem there. I think we're good. Kill it before it mutes me again. That should be possible, actually. Yeah, it's looking good. Okay, good, good, good. Oh, shit. That fucker just got me. One more time. <laughs> Alright, then. Let's get into an orbit around the other guy while we nuke the small things. Uh, you take care, Morda. So day incredible says he's been lurking. Is that a hook bill? No. Um this one is actually already a hawk. So I went straight to a hawk with from the Kestrel. And we're doing tier twos now. I guess So here's the thing, I do not really know how long I should or can stream. There's no limit because the little ones are not here. Chat, you have to tell me if I have to finish, right? I I'm on my own here. I don't know. 
uh, my whole structure my, my day had a, a very very solid structure like 6 p.m dinner twins 8 30 get re twins ready for bed and now it's like nothing <laughs> i need to go to bed i don't know 10 or something local time to be ready for work tomorrow stream till you drop fancy how that's that might be happening rather quickly. I'm not that young anymore. Skip work. Yeah, I wish I could. Man, if I had a day off tomorrow, I would... I'd do some crazy shit. But I don't, so... There's that. Let's repair this. Reload that. Did I hurt any passives? I did. Fix, fix. Fix that one. Wait a second. Work, Chi Gamer. That happens, right? Go to sleep at 11 p.m. That's, yeah, that would be crazy. I mean, it's still, you know, 11 p.m. is what? That's four and a half hours from now. I'm not going to stream for another four and a half hours. I, I had sort of lunch. <laughs> I'll have to eat something at some point and I do not do that on stream okay we got two should I go a little bit YOLO on this strike grip what do they do again strike grip hit me with kinetic I have a shit ton of kinetic resistances yeah let's YOLO this shall we what's the penalty 50% okay I think we can do this uh oh. It's gonna be funny. I'm trying to kill them with short range ammo. I hope I will not get knocked out by a wrecking shot. Looks good so far. And I'm just orbiting. This is not even me manual tanking, so. Guess we're good. Eating is for weeks, is it? Get ready. Hello to you. Colin's sick with a severe case of white wine. Why would I do white wine sippo though? Oh wow, I can see a cloud here now. This is a speed cloud. So sometimes I do see the cloud, sometimes I don't. Is this a feature or is this a bug? I have no idea. I got a serious case of Eve. Caustic has a question. Solar powered Eve question. Any special recommendation settings in Eve to run Eve efficiently? Um, not really, Caustic. I can tell you that Chida talk or Sitting in Chida Station is more expensive, resource-wise and, well, wattage-wise, than sitting in another station. So if you do ship spinning, may maybe don't do it in Chida. 4-4, four, four, that is. Uh, also, the Abyss costs a bit more than the normal known space. Uh, what else have I found out? I didn't really fiddle with settings yet. So what I'm trying to do is run sub-200 watts... Um, without compromising on visuals. That's what I do. And it's easily possible with one client on the hardware run. So the, the main thing is, is the hardware I have which makes this possible. Alright, let's go. Last loot can in uh, this one. Where am I headed? There. Frarian, have you seen what happened over the last couple of years with the graphics cards, especially? And, and well, CPUs for, for a big part as well. They are just throwing more watts at the problem. That's all they do. 
well not all but that's a big part of what they do and uh so the, the thing that opened my eyes a little bit was I had to run my AC constantly with my previous setup. Now it just turns on once in a while. So I save not only like 500 watts from my for my PC setup, I also save about a thousand watts an hour for AC. So that's basically 1,500 watt hours or 1.5 kilowatt hours I save. I don't have to pay. <laughs> that's kind of significant. Um, where was I? Docking in Sadak. Let's hit it. The next series of AMD and NVIDIA GPUs are going to use 600 to 1000 watts. That's just crazy. Okay, 13.3 million and that one is probably shit. Wait, what? 2.8 million for this? All right. The solution would be to put some, put some scrolls into a wheel connected to the dynamo. I tried that with the twins. It didn't really work yet. A thousand watt is a room heater, right? Or a toaster. So, well, my goal is to eventually run on, on solar completely with the stream. Not because I want to save the planet or whatnot. It's just... I find it an interesting sort of thing to do. I want to see if it's possible. So why would that thing be 2 million? What the hell? I'm going to try to sell it for 2.5. Let's do it. There we go. How much do I have now? F 58 million. I need to do one more run, I think, and then I could probably get the check though up and running. Let's get some more rockets. Do I have filaments? Still? Agitated dark, just one, so I need to buy two more. The rest is fine. Do I need to repair things? Nope. Wait, you have another solution. Put Urshlog into a wheel, connect it to a dynamo. That put, I, I don't... We had some some numbers lately. Like a, a professional cyclist could generate so and so much what? I, I don't know what the number was. I think it was just... It would have been just enough. But since I'm not a professional cyclist, I'm sort of the opposite of that. That wouldn't work. My mouth uses all my energy during streams. I cannot move my body meanwhile. Total Chaz's old GTX 690 eats 500 watts at full load as well. Holy shit, that thing is burning power there. A professional cyclist can just barely toast a toast. You've seen a YouTube video? Okay, so... Wait, 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 hold on a sec. Barely toast the toast. The toaster is a thousand watts, right? Oh, let's wiggle. Sikinos, thanks for that. Wait, the forty, the forty ninety is only four hundred fifty TGP. It, it, yeah, well, in the notebook configuration, Alex Stallone, right? <laughs> I don't, I don't know. I haven't uh, laid eyes on. On any other hardware for now um that notebook was pretty expensive so <laughs> we'll stay with that for the time being and i will save save a lot of power and then i can afford something new in a couple of years that's the idea so let's see if we can get 
enough with the next abyss to upgrade for uh, the jackdaw. So Ponsui says the top SQs are going to be right at around 1000 kilowatts. Holy shit, man. It's five times more than I burn here with a stream now. That's including screens and light and OXLR and whatnot. And it's even including my my switch. My switch is there as well. Uh, undock, that one. Did I, did I bring the filaments? Yes. I, I'm not sure food is, is going to be enough of... Wait, what did I just do? No, 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 worst. No, 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 no. You're not doing this. Location, let's go here this time. I see, Fonsui. Well, again, I have no intention to get another setup anytime soon. The idea is to go solar with this one first. And if the cables are not long enough, I'll have to play on the balcony. I would even save the artificial lighting, I just realized. Man, look at that. Oh, I, I see, Fonsui. There you go. Uh, we had that before. Let's just kill the, the Tangling Damovic first. That guy needs to go quickly. And there he is. Oh, I'm gonna stop my ship for a sec. Let's just make sure my missiles land on this clown. looks good okay the big guy is gonna ramp up on me in a sec and the Weber is gone let's see if I can get under the vet max guns now does not look good at the moment oh I might get there though just need to push it a bit I need to be at four or something for it to. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, I think I think I will get out of. Yeah, there we go. He's not tracking anymore. Let's hit him where it hurts. Ragnar lost his solar panels. If it was smart bombs fit, I would be dead. Ah, uh, I mean, I have quite some resistances. Well, if he would do EM, yeah, maybe. It's just a cruiser, though, right? Cruiser smart bombs are not that scary. I think I should bring some faction missiles, a faction rockets for for this situation. That would be easier to kill the the two Damovics first. So how much how much damage per second can you do with these truck sodas? Cheers, Varian. Uh, give your potatoes a hug, I guess. Mango Nick, this is one of the eternal questions in Eve. Why are smart bombs called smart? Oh, 
Alright, stage one loot was not fun. Oh, I mean, triple three million is, is gonna do it actually. For the check though. Oh wow. They might actually hurt me quite a bit. Let's go. Cool. Could actually open the loot first. They are not very fast. Another 3 mil, okay. I really need a good drop in the last room. That's gonna give me a check though, upgrade. Here I can see the clouds just clearly. This is very weird. I think there's some other environmental effect that makes it so why you can't see the clouds anymore. Must be something new. Oh yeah, smart bombs do not use ammo. That's the smart part, total chess. You're just going to empty your cap. There's only one other thing that doesn't use ammo. Well, if you have tech one crystals on on lasers, right? On yeah. Or a civilian gun. They don't use ammo either. Solar powered smart bombs. Imagine. I have to wait for a solar eclipse to to get you down, I guess. Oh, yeah, drones are also not using ammo. Good point. Drones. Do fighters use ammo? Don't think so. Alright. Thing's dead. One more room. Come on. I need... Man, I want to have like a 10 million drop now. That'd be really good. Six point two in cargo right now. A uh, hawk is fine, fastened. We are almost about to upgrade to the jackdaw. Yeah, this is the hawk fa fastened. Uh, what have we? Um, starving Damovix. That's not good. Tang. Oh god. Oh boy, this is actually dangerous. I'm gonna stop my ship. Is this one star? Oh, two starving Damovix. Yeah, we need to remove this fast. Funny thing, they didn't even hurt me yet. Oh, let's not. Let's not get too excited. Okay, first one down. Oh wait, we got a 50%, right? No, 30%. Interesting. Looking good. Just sitting here. Wow, that was easier than I thought. Beautiful.
quite a potent little ship here. I like it. Oh, really? That was mean. And yes, he's sitting here and not moving is intentional. If I move, it might create a situation where these guys are just outrunning my missiles. And I can't have that, obviously. It's not... It is a late stream, yeah, Jameson. I was late. <laughs> Remy lost, like, my AB is still on. I like this ready, you know, Remy? So I don't have to think about it later. Fixed it now. Alright, that guy's gone. Last one. Yeah, don't get used to it, Truxodos. That's that's tomorrow, or that's today, and potentially tomorrow, unless the twins are coming home earlier. Then my wife sort of estimated that maybe they're they're liking the place and they will stay a day longer. Oh my god, that would be a, that would be glorious. That would actually that would be Friday into the weekend. <sighs> maybe I can talk my wife into staying three nights instead of just two. Ah. I'll encourage her to do this more often. <laughs> Alright, let's get the loot. I should have started moving once I was only shooting, or once only the strike needles were left, right? Oh, this is a tier 2 abyss now, Foxfire. In a hawk already. Initial invest, 5 million. Kestrel, tier 1, then... Hawk, tier 2, and soon... Ah, oh shit, that was a really crap drop. I might have to do one more to get into the Jackdaw. But at least it was quick, so let's go. Wait, I'm on your big screen in, in the office, Trixodus. <laughs> let's hope boss is not walking, walking into you. Yeah, that was 8 million only. How much can I sell this for? Yeah, that's not good. Wait, what? 1 million buyout. 1.4 million cheapest. 1 mi no, yeah. 1.5 buyout. Didn't expect that. Oh wait, Truxoda says he he's the boss, he owns the company only. <laughs> Do you need some I don't know software architect with with a fifty percent sort of thing? I mean I would get one hundred percent of the salary, but I would just do fifty percent of the time. <laughs> uh let's go here. Okay, that's enough. This one, this one, this one. Sixty seven Let's see. I will try to sell this stuff. Let's see where it goes. 21 mil. 22 mil. How much can I get? I, I might have enough for the check. I just want to see. That's the case. Sell items. 22 estimate and we're going to get only 17. Ah, crap. Yeah, well, I think I have to run one more. So wait, I got 23 million plus 40, that's 63. The hull is 57, right? Yeah, that's a bit too tight. I need, I need another one. Damn. Joachim says, would you say that tier 2 is much harder than tier 1? Yes, definitely. It's a 4.5... Is it a 4.5 hour stream already? Holy crap. Yeah, but I started late. I mean, 4.5 hours isn't that uncommon. It's just the time of day I'm still on. 
but uh, let's see. What what local time is it actually? Uh, it's almost seven p.m. here. Okay, seven p.m. You know what? We could actually do a little intermission. How about the giveaway? Let's see what I have. Um, let, let's do it like this. Giveaway? Now? Raffle is on? And I will tell you what you win. <laughs> hey Blondie, thanks for the wiggle. Yeah, the price is going to be a stack of tier 0 and tier 1 filaments because I don't need them anymore. No, it's not going to be that. Actually, I found the price. So, two extended capsuleer day cerebral accelerators estimated value 200 something mil. Stay tuned. Is this for the banana price? No, that's just a regular or irregular giveaway, I should call it. Closing the raffle and here's the draw. I will need the tier 1s. When my ship, yeah, gets ganked, absolutely. All right, we have a winner. Oh, uh, pri private tier, <laughs> private tier. What is your in-game name? I have a contract for you in Chida. Privateer it is. And there you go. Your price is up. Well, your contract is up. 30 days to claim. Don't miss it. And we are back on this screen. Okay, so I have to run one more still. Just one more, right? Two filaments. Let's hope we get some interesting spawns. All right, that's good. Repairs are not necessary and off we go. I didn't have a single decent drop, did I? The, the biggest value was an 8 million isk filament so far. Alright, do better. Let's go. No? Hello? No? Why not? Now, alright. That post warp invulnerability is kind of confusing at times okay that's a Karen with a neuter so we need to take out that neuter I believe the neuter will come close so we can take that guy out whoa is there a speed cloud Karen is super fast 
Neuter is in range. Beautiful. Actually, when I quickly open that eludes as well. Switch back to the neuter. There we go. Loot. That didn't work. Why not? All right, let's do it. Again. Oh, seriously? Come on. Uh, this is. This happens so often. You, I'm a hundred percent sure I issued the command to open the loot, but nope, nothing happened. Two point three. All right. Okay, we need to get Angular. Where, where is she? There. Karen is over there. Post warp invuln is sometimes as confusing as swapping crystals and instantly having them swap back. And if you do that too early, right? So your cycle, you think your client thinks the cycle is over and lets you switch the ammo, but the server is like, nah, that didn't happen yet. Then it toggles back. That's very annoying, yeah. They should queue, allow us to queue this. I, I liked how World of Warcraft sort of worked with abilities back in the day. You could even, I believe, set the queue time for a command or something. So it would just, you know, run whatever you you do and, and would allow you to queue something before whatever you were doing right now. Uh, a little bit before the previous thing ended. That that was very, that felt re very good. They should let us queue all kinds of stuff. I mean, you know, it would probably make a, a few things harder for if somebody wants to catch you or gank you or whatnot. It might make that harder or easier to get away. So maybe that's why they don't do it. Queues would help so much with high ping, yeah. I mean, I'm not saying I want to have a long queue, just one thing after the current thing. I don't want, like, the world, right? CCP doesn't like it when you don't have to click a lot. I mean, you have the same amount of clicks, Ludicrous, if you queue something. It's just, you know, it doesn't accidentally not work because you were too early. That's the only difference. Well, then, yeah, then you have to click more because it didn't work, because you were too fast, right? Or the server. Here's the thing, it, is this server tick things, they're not very consistent, right? For, you know, with, with your latency and whatnot. It, sometimes it's really hard to predict and then you end up hitting something too early and then you get punished kind of by the client making it so you are gonna lose a whole lot, fucking other tick before you can do it again right even a skill check game I mean I I'm okay with skill checks Belly but if it sort of if your if your ping makes it harder, I think there should be a mechanism sort of account for that. That's all I'm saying here. Because it's not fun gameplay if you know your client tells you, okay, you can do this now, and then the server tells you no you can't. That is that is the worst thing you can actually do in terms of UI. Sort of indicate to the user that you can do something and then you can't that's the worst that's the number one thing that is a uh, uh, what's the word i'm looking for this is the worst atrocity in ui you can sort of do make the user believe he can and then not let him that is that's the worst in ui design it's the worst sin. Sorry, I was looking for that word. Thank you, Fonsoy. Oh, exclamation mark fit, Dan. For details about what I'm running here. And I think since I have a lot of resists, I'll just dive on these guys now. Yeah, let's go. Rage and kill them with rage. Uh, where's the... There.
So I'm picking the DPSers here first, so I can stop my shield booster. I also this situation right after downtime, right when you jump a gate and the the other system hasn't loaded yet, it would it would just tell you, hey, no, you can't do that yet. Try again later. I I don't think that's a good solution. It should just try automatically. Tier two Moto Villian. We started with a five million. Initial invest, and now we are running tier two and a hawk after four hours ish something. And I'm about to upgrade to a Chakdaw. We're very close to the Chakdaw. I need another 10 mil or so, and then we can do Chakdaw. A couple of tier twos, and then probably enough money to have a reasonable tier three fit for the Chakdaw. Will the Chakdaw do more DPS than the, than the Hawk? It might. I think it will. So even running tier 2s in the Chakdaw is going to be... Ah, uh, no, wait. I will, I will get less loot if I do that. Yeah, no, tier 2s in the Chakdaw is not a good idea. Uh, agree there, Fonsui, but again, together with the with the fact that I will get 30% less, 33% less loot because I'm running it destroyers rather than frigates, that will void that, I'm pretty sure. Does the Hawk require Omega? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, sorry, no, the Hawk? The Hawk is the... I think the Hawk is an Omega ship. Uh, the, the lower tiers, frigates probably run them uh, faster because application is better, plus frigates are way faster at the gate, especially if you run a tier zero. Don't do that in a cruiser, man. You're just wasting so much time. Can't activate? What? Oh shit, did I? I think that was an out of range thingy. If DPS is Increase is more than 33, it's still worth. Uh, here's the thing, Safin, um, the Tech 3 destroyer is going to be slower. Uh, speed, I'm talking speed here. Uh, Watchman, Null Warp, I don't know. Let's kill the Lancer first. That one goes down the quickest, and then the Null Warp Cruiser. Actually, go to the loot. That, ooh, we have a speed cloud, right? Oh shit, that speed cloud is gonna mess with me a lot. How do I? All right. Oh yeah, wait. In a, in a tier three? No, 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 no. We, we're talking tier two. So obviously running the tier 3 in the Jackdaw is going to be better than running the tier 2 in the in the Hawk loot wise but if I were to run tier 2 in a destroyer I get less loot than I get when I run it in a assault frigate Do they usually attack drones in the abyss? Yes. Some rats are more prone to do that than others, though. So you have to pay attention, especially against the uh, Tessera battlecruisers. They, they eat drones for breakfast and lunch and dinner and everything.
and are wondering if I'm going to do something with a worm in between. I don't think it makes sense. A worm is just going to be a waste of money. I'm focusing on on missile boats, I would say, and darks. And in a dark, the worm is just not going to perform. Is this the last room? Yes. Ah, oh, but the loot was bad so far, right? Wait, what? 4.8 mil. Mm. Oh, what is this? This might be good. Ah, oh, shit, I can't do that in the abyss, right? Right, right. Why not? I guess it will come down, Fonso, to what I feel more comfortable with, as in what takes less attention. The Hawk will be easier in Tier 2, you think? Yeah, definitely. Tier 3 is a, it's a pretty big step up. Maybe I should should run tier twos until I get two two jackdaws. This one looks like a an exotic, right? Green, green color in the dark. Five point eight mil. Okay, that wasn't the worst. Oh my god! Don't talk about food, B. A. James. I do not want to know about your. Pepperoni pizza there. You know what's the limiting factor for this stream now? Me getting hungry. If that happens, I'm gone. Uh, Instadoc. So what's that? A 10 million run. 10 million, alright. Sergrush, you want me to shut down the stream, do you? Hey, but <laughs> what do I have? I have. What will I eat, actually? Uh, I'll probably just have an instant noodle, something, soup, whatever. Because I'm lazy and I like these quite a bit. Not sponsored by Domino. Oh, Domino's? Oh, is it? Wait, Domino's Pizza? Oh my god. I remember that from my... From my younger years. Domino's Pizza. Holy... Wait, why is this 52 mil? Ah, uh, yeah, right. <laughs> because of the sheets. Alright. Let's sell... These... Two point three mil. Two point three mil plus forty. So I I can get seventy two million isk now. How much was the check? Seventy two. That makes it fifteen million for the fitting. I s I already have quite a. I think we can do the check though now, guys. Let's see. We can make that happen. We need a check doll fit. Check doll. Actually, let's look at that Rocky. One, okay, no, let's not look at rock. 1.3 bill, yeah, that's a slightly out of my price range right now. Okay, let's not do that. 
show info. So we will have four of these, no five actually. Five launchers and with Scourge. Ah oh, shit. Did I really just click that button? Let's let's get into sharpshooter mode. Let's try it again. One, two, three, four, five. Can we upgrade to the check though? So wait, 267 DPS. That's not great. 392 up from what? 300? 392 is decent. Cold. 462 hot. Oh, that's beautiful. Okay, so DPS wise, I'm I'm all for this. Now we need what do we need to do? Let's have let's keep the fit similar for now. Okay, tank is gonna be worse. Cap booster, I I get that there. Okay, I got one more. But, wow, this is nice. I need an AB now. AB. Let's go with the compact AB. And this is going to be the main issue. Uh, this ship is going to be way slower. 1MN. Where are we? 1MN during. Oh my god. So I had like 900 meters a second, and I'm going down to 550. Now, in I will obviously get like, what, 800 because dark, but wow. That's going to be a pain in the ass. Can you fly Tech 3, Tier 3, Tech 3 Abyssals? Yes, but only the destroyers, not the cruisers. In propulsion mode, I will have more speed, yes, but uh, still 200 meters less per second than I got with the other guy. So I'm not super happy about this. But I will get better range. Uh, 14 kilometers out of the box. And I, uh, I'm i playing with thought to... Should I add a third? Or damage control? Hold on. These numbers are not really nice. I think I would like a damage control to have a little bit more time when shit hits the fan. Could. Should I do an invuln here? I think I have to do an invuln. Uh, multi spectrum. Multi-spectrum shield hardener. Yeah, I think I want that option. So I don't have to switch to defense mode quickly, too quickly. Well, therefore, I need to plug my little EM hole there. In a rig. That is rig number one. Shields, small shields. How much is it? 1.9 million? That's actually fine. I said I... Th what, do I have 72 million, right? 72 million to play with. The faster you blow them up, the less you tank you need. Absolutely. 441. That's kind of nice. I'm not super happy with my EM resists there. But I guess I'll have to bite that bullet. If I go to tank mode, yeah, I will get about the same numbers uh, as I got with the Hawk. Alright. I think I will I will do this. Triple, and then I need a range rig. That, that's totally gonna happen. Missile launcher rig. But I'm not... My, my capacitor... Whoa, my capacitor is actually really not good. So I need the 
not the bay loading accelerator hydraulic bay thrusters that's gonna give me 17 kilometers that's that's nice two kilometers more than i had and now i need i need some energy stuff engineering rig oh i'm not happy with this oh man i'm <sighs> 148. Wait, CC maybe? Not super happy with this. How's the verdict in the skill books? I, I haven't gotten any yet. Did you ever play Final Fantasy XIV? I actually played a few times uh, for like, I don't know, three or four hours and then I stopped because... They made me play content that's very old, right? Moto Villian says he likes flycatchers for destroy. Oh yeah, flycatchers. But nah, I don't want to do that the tour really. Something Wong Fosho for sure says uh, he was running the Chakdo for long. He was wondering why his DPS full tech two got him only like two hundred. Turns out the Tech 3 Destroyer skill was a 2. Yeah, you want to get that up a little. So I like this DPS. If if things are really... I can get... Wow, 500 if I really need to push it. That's very, very nice. I'm rather slow. There's that. I could go for a Tech 2 battery, though. To make this a bit... Yeah, a bit more chill. Thing is, I have way less tank. My tank is probably 30% less than what I had before. I'm not happy about that. I do kill... For, so for a tier 2, this is fine, but... Oh, for a tier 3... Solo, I am not sure about this. In a tier 3, I definitely need a blue pill with this. And man, I'm not sure about the... Jeez, I'm not sure about this either. 1 minute 54. This is not a this is not a tier three runner yet. The tank is not enough. I think I will need something like something like this in the mix. And that is obviously not in my budget yet. Yeah, I'll need this. You're early, funky bass man. You're not running tier threes with this motor villain, are you? So I'm trying to get to tier three as fast as possible, motor villain. That's the whole point. I, I will I will run the tier twos with the frigate because it gives me more loot. What if you run another EM rig instead of what? Hydraulic bay thrusters? I don't think I can do that. Um so drummer, I'm only running darks, that's not gonna help much other than my prop mod really. So, yeah, I don't think upgrading to the Chak doll is a good idea at this point. Without the Pith MC type medium shield booster, this is a really dumb idea. How about 
How much is a Gestum seed toy? <sighs> Same price. Uh, not really. Well, it helps me get stable, but... Shit. Yeah, I need I need a blingy, blingy tank module for this to work. Otherwise, I'm screwed. Unless... I, I do not want to skip these resists. They can really save my ass there. So I basically need to get another 70 mil first. And then we can fit it like this, and that should do the trick. With a blue pill, I think I can make this work. Yeah, not now though. Okay. Yeah, the Hawk it is for, I guess, part two. Um, as well, what time is it? Yeah, I think... I don't want to push it too much. I don't want to bore you the whole evening with, with more tier 2 Hawk runs. We will continue this little experiment on another day. That is the plan. But for now, let's see who else is there. As in, actually there and not just doing reruns most of the day. Uh, who is there? Ooh, Zipando says, big fight kicking off. Let's have a look at what at this stream. Oh yeah, Zipando. Shit's gonna go down. Oh, let's prepare the raid there. Okay, that's it from my end. Everybody, thanks a lot for the support today, hanging out for all the follows and the conversation. I will be back again tomorrow from hopefully downtime. I have to go to work physically tomorrow. So that might be a bit later, uh, but if all goes as planned, no twins home yet. So wish me luck in that regard. Also, if you want to help kick the establishment in the uh, in the balls, check out this Discord. We are trying to rig the CSM elections. Uh, well, we have a normal Discord. You can hang out as well. Obviously, there is YouTube, there is Twitter, there is other things you will find that stuff i'm heading out have a great one and i'll see you uh, soon bye bye